Hi. Um, <laughs> I'm back. Welcome. To Alondra. The music got like way quieter outside of that. Hold on, maybe I can boop it back up to where it was. The music on the opening is like crazy loud. Let's see. Is that, is it still super loud? Sorry, I'm like fucking around. Usually I'm able to do this the night before. Anyway, hey, thank you to everyone who uh, stayed. Oh, it's doing it again. Huh? Ha, 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 ha. I will enjoy this. Oh, thank you, Rosa. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Look how pretty. Oh, I don't know if you can see. Alundra. It's got like shiny um, holographicness to it. I'm really digging it. Fun fact, I love this game more than I love Zelda. Really? Interesting. Yeah, it's all like foily and, oh, I should have shown you the disc before I put it in. Uh, it's, it's weird. It's a big case like this, but it's only one disc and everything is like fancy and foil. Like even the back, hold on. Even the back, as you can see, all the text and all the stuff around it is holographic too. It's all foil. It's so cool. I really dig it. it uh, the game itself looks quite blurry, though. I'm gonna have to fuck around with the, um, the size of this. The guy in the cover looks just like Link. It's so interesting. Yeah, somehow a Lundra won. I'm not sure. It's weird because the last poll it was in, it got last place. Um, but yes, hello. Uh, we have switched games because I beat Metal Gear Solid. Haha. -ha. So I'm gonna have to fuck around with this a little bit. Um, I do apologize. It's a. Uh, it's the way it is, because it's that or I save this for tomorrow. So, let me just, um, I'll mess around with my settings a bit. The opening is blurry normally? Okay. It's just weird, because, the, like, the borders aren't, uh, aren't matching up. Uh, Panzer Ruin, thank you for following. Thank you, thank you. Also, let me know if you need me to turn the music down still. see. How can I mess with you? Because the size seems to be different than Metal Gear. Ah, I might have to do a different multiplication time for our, um, this thing. So sometimes I can... Let's see. Let's change the, uh... Don't mind me. Don't you enjoy these behind the scenes things? I actually can't do this, like, if uh, if I can't see myself, so. Still seems a bit small. It's a video, all right. Oh, good Lord, can I not skip it? Oh yeah, I can. <laughs> Interesting. What? Oh, I think it's because I don't have a continue. I'm not allowed to touch it, okay. That's interesting. Sorry, I have to like fiddle. It looks beautiful on the Vita. It's on the PS3 store. Oh, interesting. I definitely want to watch the beginning, but we might have to fiddle around. I have no idea which button I pressed to make it go, by the way. It didn't do like a sound to confirm. I might not have even done anything. I don't think I did. <laughs>
Rip by Rule Castle. <laughs> It might still be a bit loud, sorry. This opening seems to be like crazy loud. Oh my god, this game's gonna be hard, huh? One disc, by the way. This opening is so long! This is so bizarre to see now when I was a kid. This looked like the best game I'd ever seen in the trailers. I can't blame you. Holy crap! That's incredible. Actually, I don't even... Can I use this controller? I'm realizing... This controller's not working at all. I can't get it to, like, do anything. Hold on. Let me bother Rain. My analog thing was still on, so it wouldn't let me in. It wouldn't let me in. Anyway. All right. We might have to do a little bit of fixing. Let me know if the sounds are, like, way too loud or way too quiet. Tell me each stream is going to open with this movie. Oh, that looks much better. Okay. in player two they made me change that back anyway uh let's start a new notebook page it's me welcome everyone thank you for sticking around metal girl strike here's all of us great um all right alundra so i've never played this game before i don't know anything about it uh, we can read the back. It's very pretty. Like, this is one of the, like, pr see, do you see that? It's one of the prettiest cases I've ever seen. I'll read the little back, because there's, like, a special message on the back. Between the worlds of... <laughs> we'll listen to these birds. Between the worlds of light and dark lies the world of dreams. A world where the rule of reason loosens its grip. A place where an insidious evil is stealing minds and blackening the hearts of those from the world of light. Sounds so much like Zelda, doesn't it? Grab a weapon and become the dreamwalker of Alundra as he struggles to purge the evil id of an ancient world before it falls to ash. Explore dungeons, find weapons, solve challenging puzzles, and kick some serious monster butt as you weave between tense reality and nightmarish dreams to save the hapless masses. With a wide cast of characters and scores of challenging puzzles created by the people responsible for Land Stalker Diem, on the Genesis, Alundra will rob you of precious sleep until you finish. That's the fucking back message holy shit this is the same company that put out lunar oh yes i need to play that too incredible all right i will not look at the manual it is in here but i won't look at it until unless we need it i hit myself in the face <laughs> i'm so excited 
Also, um, new poll is up. Exclamation mark poll will get you a link. Uh, I warned you it was going to be mean. The options are Grandia, Illusion of Gaia, or Valkyrie Profile. So, vote for the one you'd like to see the most, and we'll play that next. Also, don't feel too bad for Okami and Musashi. They will be coming back in a later poll. They are not gone forever. So, let's... Ooh, I don't jump in. Let's play a video game. What? Yes, I own Valkyrie Profile. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. Uh, again, uh, if if the if it, I sound too quiet, if the game sounds too quiet, um, please or too loud, please let me know. My shoes are huge. Are there any? <gasps> Look at my giant forehead! I have a small dagger. Needs more bird. Oh my god, going in the menu makes the bird stop. <gasps> cool. The seagulls are coming in Laden Flare. Great. I assume that's a use item of sorts. Ooh. Okay, the triggers are quick. Quick open your menu. Where's, oh, talk is the same as slash? That doesn't seem good. I can't tell you how weary I am of looking at the sea in the clouds for days. I'll be so happy to be on dry land again. Is there... Where's options? Oh, crud. I don't think I can make the text faster. I can hold it down, though. Yeah. What you been wanting, boy? Have you forgotten where your cabin is? Yes. Hmm? What? But X is confirm? That's so weird. Damnation! For the fifth time, lad, your cabin is the one on the right. Uh, you're certainly not the sharpest cutlass on the rack. Am I a, a seaman? I'm returning to my beloved. I've nearly forgotten how it feels to hold her in my arms. And what of you? Why do you travel to Torla? Torla. The old anime helmet. Hermit. <laughs> it looks like someone from Record of Lotus War. That's something that people have mentioned a lot, I think, in stream. You should play along? You totally should play along! What? Your dreams led you to the ship? You ain't one of them freak boys, are ya? I mean... Am I? I, I don't think I'm a freak boy! <laughs> oh, thank you, Shiroyoni. I hope you have a really lovely night. One good thing about playing non-voiced games is my voice acting. I'm so sorry. It's gonna be terrible. It's the way it is. I'm certainly not a voice actor, I don't claim to be. Hey, <laughs> Malice Last. Yes, we are on a new game. I really like that I can bounce around. Can I jump on this? What? Okay. We're feeling seasick. Arr, drop anchor over the side, boy. <laughs> I just swapped the Bloomin' Dex. I wish I could barf over the side. You, shut up. Shh. Headed, you're headed for the village of in Inoa. That's a good distance from Torla. Okay, so I'm headed to in Inoa. <laughs> oh, thank you, guys. You want his backpack? Me too. What kind of business takes you to such a remote place? I don't know. Beautiful, eh? I've been a sailor since I was a lad younger than you. I haven't even tired of watching the waves roll across the pristine waters beneath the bow. The bow wow. <laughs> Reversed! Oops! <gasps> Excuse me? I can hold the fuck up. Did you see that? I jumped over that man and walked on his head. Can I do that again? Was it because of the stairs? Incredible. I've heard of Sea of Thieves. I've heard quite a bit about Sea of Thieves. I know some of my friends played it, but I have not. I actually kind of hate water in the ocean, so. Oh, hello. Merrick. I wonder, I'm not sure. Okay, so I'm currently on a boat to Torla. Seems to be the captain. What's the matter, kid? You look at my pale. Mm. I've been having the same troubling dream every single night. 
Ah, it's the seasickness fogging your land, love and mind. It'll pass. If you'll excuse me, I'd better tend to ease in the ship into port. It should be near. Wow, this translation is like actually quite good. I can Can I have this? Can I have this book? I can just like climb all over everybody's shit. This is insane. He's gonna punch me. <laughs> There's a weird boy in here. Jumping on my bed. It doesn't seem there's like a check item or like see if you can interact. Because so far slash and interact are square, which are the same. This music is giving you Final Fantasy VI vibes. Eh? Oh. Shut up, bird. Hold on one second. Let's see what it looks like. I'm gonna kill it. It's fine. Don't panic. Just restarting. My Elgato has been getting a little slow lately. It's okay, that's just RGB. That synced up better. Oh! Just fell all the way down. Liked the pink. It's uh, totally normal. Where did you see my cabin was? The one on the right. <laughs> I know I'm not very sharp. He says the one on the right, but I'm not sure what he means by that. Oh, like up here? Oh goodness, there's places down there too. I see, that's what they meant. Oops, sorry. You were screaming in your sleep again last night, boy. I could have sworn you were on fire. Alright, so dream world and waking world, that's gonna be the thing. There's a crack in the wall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the rush to fix it? I'm in no hurry. Well, that doesn't seem like a very good thing to avoid. Oh, this big crack? Huh. On a boat, it's called Starboard? Oh, excuse me. Starboard and Larboard. How could I forget? Alundra's cabin. Wait, is my name Alundra? so weird. I can, like, get in the bed. Am I supposed to sleep? My shoes are too big. It's a bit upsetting. back to your quarters. The horizon's looking dark as night, and the seas turn into might restless. There's a storm room. Okay. Can I sleep? Huh? Cloth armor. Short boots. Short boots? Those don't look very short to me. Oh, I see. These both open different... No, they don't. What am I... How did I open that? Oh, I see. Oh, weird. <laughs> Your average height? Sorry. Oh, I think I understand. I wonder if I run into it. This must be my first puzzle. Where's the run button again? Eh? Maybe not. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just going to wreck my face. God, it's so weird playing it. I'm like completely still thinking about Metal Gear nonstop. It's so bizarre trying to switch games while you're in the middle of the day. Oh! What? 
I can pick up boxes and throw them. The heck was that? I'm not getting anything. Eh? Can I put it back down without chucking it? Nope. Do what I want. Weird. <laughs> I did, I did beat it. Thank you. So weird. Okay, so I can pick items up as well. Every button is, it's all the same button. The feeling says, oh, this is the same thing he said. Headed for the village of Anoa. Huh. Well, this is a good sign. I know. Alright, Captain. What the fuck's going on? About the boots? So nobody mentioned that this is Kingdom Hearts? I hope not. Oh, he moved. You're making me nervous, kiddo. Go lie down for a while. Why not have yourself another one of those freaky dreams while you're at it? It's not very nice. Can I... I can't pick up his book. Alright, everybody's telling me to go to sleep, so... I'll try to go to sleep. I wonder if the boxes respond. They did. Oh! It's controlling me. Yes! Oh! <sighs> okay. Lars? Can you hear me? Wait. Can you hear me? I am the one known as Lars. I am a wizard and one of the guardians of the seal. The time grows short before I am bound once more. Thanks, Grammar. Have a good rest of your day. Huh? Just an actual scream? Can you hear me, Releaser? North of Enoa is a deep, dark lake. Below its murky surface, a wretched demon has slumbered for a thousand years. Now the foul beast stirs once more. We stand on the threshold. Nell's ass. You make me laugh, feeble one. No one has the power to stop me now, especially not a miserable human. Tell me then, Melzas, if humans are so powerless, how is it that prosperity is your only by hm? Your own- hm? What? <laughs> Don't you understand, wizard? Humans have long since ceased being of use to me. Their presence in my reality has become nothing more than a thorn in my side. Soon I shall- Why do you snicker, old man? Do you dare to mock my judgment? This is a mess. I laugh. I laugh because you're afraid. You talk of destruction, yet you fear the strength of humanity. Why else would you come here? Now, to stop me from sending my message of redemption. Admit your cowardice, foul fiend. What in the fuck game did I agree to play? I'm not so cruel as to steal away the last shred of hope from one drawing his final breath. Believe what you will, Lars. 
but do tell me about this person you call the Releaser. What is his name or hers? Releaser. I think that's me. My time in this world has come to an end, Releaser. But I have served my purpose. You now know of the great power locked within you. Do I? Heed my words, Releaser. Travel to Enoa. Use your strength to stop the demon. I now travel to the next world. Releaser! There's a lot of flashing happening. Good lord. <laughs> Today it is Lars. Tomorrow it is you, Releaser. And then the end of mankind. It is destiny. It is fate. Sorry, I didn't know there was going to be a flashing light. Oh, what the fuck? Oh my god, it's like physically pushing me. The door is jammed shut. Shit! Oh my god. Fast, everyone. I've sailed this ship through storms twice as ferocious. This guy's dead, isn't he? I listen to the captain. The lady of the sea could never raise a swell strong enough to polish off the Clark. Is that the ship? Captain, we're headed straight for the reef. Hold on, sweet mother of God, we're... Thank you, thank you. Please try hard again, hard. Okay, sorry. I, I clearly didn't save the boat. No. Awake. This is progress. This is good. I was afraid you might be having an eternal rest. You know what I'm saying? My name is Jess. I'm a swordsmith here in Anoa. Decent money. Make my own hours. No big whoop. No big whoop. <laughs> when this come out? Oh fuck! I missed it! God damn it. You were on board the Clark, were you not? Alundra? That's so weird. I thought that it would, um. It wouldn't skip it. You're lucky to be alive, you know what I'm saying? They've not found a piece of that ship bigger than my fist. I totally missed a line. I'm sad. Welcome to Working Designs. But let us not talk about that. Let us talk about you, my new friend. You are welcome to stay here until you're fully recovered. I live by myself. Once you leave, I'll be a lonely fat- What? I'll be a lonely old fat man again. Not that you should feel bad. Uh, I almost forgot. That book next to the bed, it's a special diary. You want to use it, fine by me. I got it for myself, but how many ways can you write? Made a sword today? <laughs> This, this guy's great! Okay. Save your progress. Yes. It's so weird that interact, sword, lift is all X, or um, square, and then I have to like hold it down to make text go a little, little bit faster. And then I have to press X 
No, I have to hold square to make it go faster, then I have to press... Oh, bizarre. Press X. Oh, Book Club for Games, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome, raiders. Perfect timing, because we're just, 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 just starting Alundra. Oh, no worries, no worries. I hope you had a good stream, and I hope you have a good night. Inscribe my exploits? Yes. I actually didn't check to see if I had room uh, in this memory card, because this is literally the memory card. It was just saving all those, all those Metal Gear saves them too. Done. Ooh! Yeah, we just, just, just started, so welcome in, everybody! <sighs> Wonder why they never give Alundra the big box treatment? I don't know, I've gotta say, this is gorgeous. Like, the box they gave it, because it's a single disc game, is quite pretty. Um, compared to what I'm used to, anyway. But yeah, I can jump on everything and, like, cause trouble. Alright, so this nice man- okay, so literally we just started. We were on a boat heading to a town called Inoa. We made it there, but only because we fucking crashed and I think everybody on the ship died. Uh, but this nice guy just saved us. So that's cool. <laughs> it looks like I have money on the right. I definitely have sword. I think that's my health, maybe? The little blips? Ooh. Oh, right, you're like an armorsmith. What's up? Talk is the same button as stab, by the way, so... Not my fault if it looks like I'm slashing at people. I'm not doing it on purpose. You have no manual again? No, I have a manual. It's only for, like, SNES games that I don't... Fuck, I hate that! It skips the text. Where's my options? I don't think I have any. <sighs> Both Suikoden and Legend of Lagaya were one disc games with the cases. Oh, that's true. Mm. No, I have the manual. I just, I don't feel the need to look at the manual unless I need to. Those counters used to be stacked high with weapons, but weapons are art, Alondra. They do not happen unless creative juices are flowing. You know what I'm saying? I've not tasted those special juices for a long time. Ugh, so many people in this small village. Have you met them all yet, Alondra? I have your treasure. Chest is locked. If the keyhole shape wasn't so unusual, it could be picked. I could pick locks? Yeah, I have the manual. You feel strong enough to explore the village? This is good. The people of Inoa are very nice. Not as nice as me, of course, but they try. If you start to feel weak, be sure to come back here and rest, all right? Why is there uh-ing? Sybil. You're the one from my dreams. The one summoned from the realm of our unconscious. Excuse me? You've come to save us. Hi. Your appearance is just as it was in my dreams. Alundra. Well, perhaps you're a little shorter. What the fuck? Where'd that dog go? Dog? Oops! I was trying to pet the dog, not slice the dog. Okay. Wish you had the manual. I have it. I mean, if I feel like I need it, I'll totally look at it, but... Generally, I... Don't feel the need to... To look at them all the time. What is that? That's such a weird... I could get in it. Ooh. Oh. Talus? I, I, you know what? I was writing everybody's names down, but I, I, I'm so paranoid from other games. You talking to me? You talking to me? I'm the son of the mayor. When I wish to address you, peasant, I'll let you know. This stairway is off limits, so just buy a clue and beat it. Wow! Okay. Oop. Fuck off, kid. Oh, hi. Oh, I wanted to jump on the trees. Hi. Good day, adventurer. Wait, hold on a second. You're the lucky guy that Jess called from the beach. Your name is Alundra, isn't it? 
I'm pleased to meet you. What can I do for you today? There's so many limes. Hello, Alundra. Whatever you need, I should have it here for you. Oh, I see. I don't have any money. I'm dreadfully sorry, but that armor is simply not for sale. You see, it's been in my family for ages since my father's father's father, in fact. You understand, don't you? Okay. I don't have any money. What is this? A pot? A jar? Do I have to, like, bring it to you? Ugh! Sorry. Um. What? <laughs> I think this is how I buy this. <laughs> That's really cool. I have to, like, pick them up and toss them at, at her. Thought you might enjoy Bizarro Bunny. Oh my, that is strange. <laughs> I didn't mean to throw it at her. I just, I don't know. Ah, uh, yes, a tonic. The prime choice of adventurers such as yourself. It costs 15 gilder. No. I'm sorry I couldn't be of more assistance. Let me know if you need help with anything else. What's this? A life vessel. Hmm, pricey, but a prime choice for the especially discriminating. It's 500? No. Steal? I bet I could steal things. I'm not gonna do that, though. I don't know if there's, like, some type of fucking morality system. I don't know what the bullshit of this game is going to be yet, as I throw this woman's boxes. So that looks like hell. See, because it's full already. Interesting. Oh, what a creepy... Creepy portrait! Apparently Alundra is a real name, but it's Spanish, and it's supposed to be feminine. I mean, this person can be whoever they want to be. That's cool. I didn't know it was a real name. It's so weird that I can, like, fall off of ledges. Chicken? Wait, this is, like... I... Okay. I'm not stealing. I'm not gonna, like, go out of my way to steal. Who are you? Yo, Stel. You're the boy who was rescued from the beach by Jess. I'm Yustel. I magically unfold the secrets of futures not yet beheld. If you must know your destiny, stand before my crystal ball. Really? Do you wish to know your fortune, releaser? How do they... Okay. Yes. Oh, I see. I see. The path you are to take is revealed within the light of my crystal ball. Your first act should be to make friends with the villagers of Inoa. Actually, the crystal didn't tell me that. It's just good manners. Didn't your mother teach you anything? You wish to know more, Releaser. My wisdom will cost you the mere pittance of 15 guilders. Okay. No. I don't have those. Sorry. Mm -mm. Yes, a frugal one, you. The darkness spreads thick as night before your eyes. But you look into your heart for light and press on as if without fear. Strength and magic power have been completely refreshed. Oh. When you lose your way, return here and let the knowledge within the crystal guide you. Cool. Alright, so that is similar to Zelda then. I have like a fortune teller. <laughs> yeah, it feels really nice to have a jump. Hi, chicken! I want to pick you up, but I think it's going to make me slice you. Shit. I don't want to scare that crow. I wonder if befriend it. Sorry, crow. There doesn't seem to be anything in these bushes yet. brought much joy to Jess, lad. I haven't seen him this happy in ages. I just realized that if his son had survived birth, he'd be at your age by now. And his wife would be, well, that's just foolish talk. I can't change the past. God damn it. Wendell is nearing the end. How horrid it must be to lie in that cold bed imprisoned in his own decaying body. Who? Oh! Shit. Sorry. 
sorry. I didn't know I could lift that, and I didn't mean to break it. This town's gonna hate me. <laughs> Look at the font. Ooh. There's a bunch of treasure in there. I feel like the town is going to hate me because I keep accidentally breaking their stuff. It respawns. It's not like it's broken forever. Oh! Dog! Did you just fucking fall? Okay. Oh. No. Ugh. Grandpa, you need help. I'll be right back, I promise. You can't die, Grandpa. You just can't die. No. Old man crying. What is this? Grandpa, I brought someone to help, just like I said. Is he wearing the amulet of Nava? It was supposed to protect him. The only person who can help him now is Septimus. I'm sure of it. My grandpa's having a nightmare, and we need Septimus to help him. He's in the house to the left of what? This one. Go outside and up the stairs. Please hurry, bring him here right away. Oh, jeez, okay. Is that you? Giles! Do you believe in the gods? No. Then you simply have yet to feel their presence. You don't even realize that the gods are the ones who guided you here. Oh wait, I'm supposed to go up the stairs! Hello? No, I'm an idiot. I probably went the wrong way. I honestly think he said to the left, but there's only a house to the right, and I was like, okay, I'll go to the right. <laughs> this man is going to die. Fucking running. Does that mean here? Hello? Whoa. Is there a Septimus here? Are you him? There we go. I can't bear to go. I can't look at their tear-filled eyes and tell them that I don't know what to do. All these damn books, all my years of study, and I can't free Wendell from his nightmare. I'm not a scholar, I'm a fool. Are you sure? Okay. Uh... Shit. Us. Uh, wait. Let me see your forehead. You. You bear the scar. I do? Is that why my hair is so long on my forehead? Hold on. Let's look at the booklet. Oh, yeah. I forgot to tell you guys. Oh, my God. There's a map with this. Everybody. Oh my god. Look. How fucking cool is that? This is like really thick paper stock too. And, and, and. It's, um, look. It's like, it's popped out. It's so fucking cool. Oh my god. It's like the thickest manual. Alright, maybe we should read some of this. I don't want to get spoiler. I don't see a scar. I'm trying to find pictures of him. Here we go. I don't want to look at anybody else in the cast, but... Gifted with the ability to dreamwalk, Alundra is able to enter the pe enter into people's dreams and actually change the outcome. In one of his own dreams, Alundra was instructed to journey to the village in Oa. Is he ready for the nightmare that awaits him there? Oh boy. Okay. Did you see the translations notes? I can look at that after this. I'm Septimus. For years, I've studied the human mind and the world of dreams. In one of my ancient books, a legend is written of a boy with a mark on his forehead. He is said to be at once blessed and cursed. Granted, the awesome power to enter the dreams of others as they slumber. At least, I always believed it was a, but a legend. But this is a JRPG, my friends. I have a favor to ask of you, Dreamwalker. I petition you to journey to the home of Tarn, my former teacher. Oh. Okay. Septimus wants us to go to Tarn? 
I can hear, um, Leaf Lower Man, by the way. Perhaps it will yield a clue. Something to explain what's happening to Wendell, and perhaps a way to stop it. To find the house head directly east from this place. Got it. East to Tarn. Cloth maps are your weakness. Have some cloth maps from Ultima. Ugh, so cool. Oh, hey, Omni Gamer. Thank you. Couldn't even give a lunge or two a chance. Oh, I see, I see. A lunge or two was not a lunge or two. Oops. Wow. This is so neat. All right. I don't think I've ever played a game by work or worked on by working designs or whomever. I'm gonna miss Leaf Floor Man. How am I supposed to know it's Tuesday once you move? I don't know. <laughs> I'll just announce it's Tuesday. I'll go to Wendell and try to ease his suffering for the present, but please hurry. For if we cannot ease Wendell's pain, I fear I shall have the inevitable task of ending it. Good luck, friend, and thank you. Jeez, alright. Look at all his bits and bobs here. <clears throat> oh yeah, so I really love reading those. Thank you, Austin. Let's let's check. Wow, translation notes, yeah. We first saw this great game in action at the Tokyo Game Show back in April of 1997. From the first 10 seconds of playing with it, we knew we had to release this title in America. The obvious influence of Landstalker-style play mechanics and art told us that at least a few of the Landstalker team had to be involved. It turns out we were right. The original main programmer and the main scenario writer for Landstalker were responsible for what has beco had become Alundra. Being big fans of Landstalker on the Sega Genesis, we were in heaven! Look at this nerdery! After licensing the game, we began translation of text and compiled our usual wish list of changes. The biggest change we made was to copy a portion of the great animation from the ending of the game to a completely new opening at the front of the game. The original opening was simply a long string of gameplay footage that didn't get us too excited about the game itself. The new opening features an all-new CG rendered Alundra logo and exciting new music. We hope it pumps you up about what to expect in the game. There were a host of other minor changes made to the game to improve playability and limit user frustration. The status menu was made accessible from L2 and R2 buttons instead of just start. We also adjusted the timing of the buttons that appear and disappear in a, a lane stream. Oh wait, there's like weird stuff in here. Um, monster difficulties were also rebalanced generally to make a few of the bosses easier to kill. However, bosses were also made more dangerous in that if they manage to hit Alundra, their blows are much more lethal. Okay. So they made them easier but harder at the same time. This lessened some of the boredom of later bosses, where they really weren't much challenged to fight, but took forever to kill. We also rewrote the closing song with all new lyrics that we felt more closely reflected the tone of the game. Hopefully you love the game as much as we do. Be sure to drop a line, snail mail, or via www.workingdesigns.com with any ideas you have for RPG or strategy games you'd like to see us bring over to the US. Without you, the fans, we are nothing. Stay in touch, okay? Thanks, Octavia, for pulling my light. Damn, that's incredible. Oh, darling, what have you done? Uh, thanks, Rain, for doing whatever the fuck that was. <laughs> Great job. Good. Well, there's the outside. Maybe don't, don't touch my stuff, okay? Don't you love it when rain's on stream? Octavia, like, pulled my light, but then rain broke the whole thing. Hopefully it stays. Anyway, that's really cool. I'm gonna fucking... See. My windowsill is covered in dying plants, sadly. Oh, I did not show the art on the desk. Oh, crap. I mean, I can't do it now. I guess I could save and then... Wait, there's two dogs. I could save and pop it out. We'll, we'll do that at the end of stream. How about that? Um, when we finish tonight, we'll, uh, I'll pop out the disc and I'll show you what it looks like so we can see. Oh, <gasps> a coin! 
I finally got some money. Okay, now that I'm done, you know, wasting time, let's save this, uh, this guy. We have to go, well, let's finish talking to everyone, I think. We have to go east of this village to Tarn to find um, Septimus's former teacher. Maybe I should tell them that I'm not going to be able to save their poopa right now. Did we see Octavia at all during Metal Gear? I don't think so. I was too stressed out. Uh, she's currently not in her bed. She's on the other side of my monitor being bad. Oh, all we can do now is put our hope in the hands of the gods. Sorry, kid. Alondra, please hurry up and bring Septimus to us. Oh, well, he's not going to help you. Sorry. Landstark was a great Genesis game. It had two other sequels on other consoles beside Alundra. Lady Stalker on SNES and Dark Savior on the Saturn. Lady Stalker's okay and Dark Savior is a beautiful mess and you love it? Interesting. Um, I've never played Landstalker, so I'm a bit surprised that this is a sequel to something. Hey you, peasant. You plan to reside in our fair village. Well then, from this moment forth, you are my servant, understand? If you don't do whatever I say, I'll tell my dad. He's the mayor. And he'll tear you a new one, peasant. Wow, I hate this kid. Dark Savior is a thing. They're necessarily sequels, more like spiritual successors. Ah, oh, I see. Fucking shit's all messed up. Thanks, cat and husband. I don't know, this is very, um, this is interesting. I don't know if I've ever played anything like this. Ugh. Horrifying deer. Beaumont. I heard that Wendell is on his deathbed. I hope the poor man is able to recover. Hi there. You can stay as long as you want, alright? Oh. Why is your son such a piece of shit? You're fine. Dark Savior's really something. Sounds like it's pretty divisive. I'm, now that I know there's multiple discs, I'm like super curious to see which one I have. Actually, I have a picture of it in um, my uh, my price charting uh, vlogs. I probably shouldn't be destroying their stuff, but... I'm curious if there's like consequences. I guess we'll find out. It's really something in a good way. Interesting. Hmm. Oh, I love that the puppies like climb over stuff too. All right, I think that means I can leave now. Let's check in with the, I wanna make sure I talk to everybody though. Hey. Tarn's Manor. You mean the house in the East Forest? The place has been abandoned for 10 years at least, Alundra. Many bad things there, you know, what I'm saying. I actually, I can't believe it. I really enjoy this localization so far. It's very, very, um, it's got a lot of character to it. Promise, fuck, I hate that. I really don't like when text finishes early. Promise me you won't go there, okay? Okay. No, I'm gonna go there. Sorry, bud. I know you protected me or whatever, but... I'm letting this guy die. Hey, welcome back, Perkvaka! Yay! Good, I'm glad. We just just started, so perfect timing. Two, two, wait. Your two go-to Saturn games were Dark Savior and Dragon Force? I have a bunch of recommendations, thanks to all of you, for um, Genesis. I haven't quite figured out how to stream from it yet. Um, I'm a little afraid of it, if I'm being honest. I've never had any Sega anything. Um, so, I still have to fiddle with it. Maid's wife? I'm pretty sure I saw Rumi headed for... Magiscar? It's the birthplace of all living things. What the fuck? I'm gonna have too many notes. And they're all gonna be all over the place. And also the dark pit to which everything returns in the end? We go there if someone we love is dying. We call out to his or her spirit to stop them from crossing into the next world. Damn! Kind of dark. Even though we didn't get the best doggo game this time around, I'm glad we've got puppers in this game, me too. 
Yeah, I was trying to look into Shining Force uh, this morning, but um, all this house stuff, we really can't afford anything right now. It's really frustrating. We'll get there. It just takes time. But we have a huge backlog to get through, so it's fine. <laughs> I see Sierra and I think of Sweet and into Ruin Me. Have you met Elaine yet? Her mother ran off with a minor when she was just a child. If that hadn't happened, Elaine would not have, well, you know, poor thing. What? Some good Genesis games, but overall it's a weaker system for JRPGs and action RPGs compared to SNES. Mm. Ooh, who are you? Are you drunk? Oh geez, yeah. Bring me some whiskey. What do you mean, no? I'm totally tober. <laughs> Secret and enlightened you? It changed the way that I approach games. Oh. It has been so long, Alundra. Why did you come here? Don't just stand there, tell me. You don't have to yell, just leave me alone. Oh my god, okay. This poor fucking girl. Can I have your stuff? Anything back here? I wonder if that stays there for a minute. It might disappear. Last processing sounds like farts. <laughs> Change your mind. Hmm. I'm pretty sure those little diamonds are my health, but I haven't lost any health, so I can't quite tell yet. I'm just cleaning up your house of these dirty pots. Ugh. Genesis had a number of technically stronger bits and pieces, but more poorly integrated and harder to make the best use of. Oh. All Genesis Shining Forest and Fantasy Star games are unseen for very cheap. Ah, I see, I see. Ooh, <gasps> a coin! Okay, so it looks like that's gonna be one point, and then the bigger ones will be five. So it looks like they use the same consistency with health bips and money bips. Yeah. Okay. I didn't name him Alundra, that's just what they're calling him. What? You're going to Tarn's Manor. Very, very bad idea. You'd be lucky to come out of that creepy joint with your life. Okay. Clearly, these people know better than me. Hmm. How many coins I need? Chickens? Cutsy'd me in here. Hello? What'd she do? Oh. Case of the big forehead. Nadia? Hmm? <gasps> oh man! I know I should have had that extra cup of coffee. That's the third table so far this week. Nadia, are you alright? Check yourself for splinters, dear. It'll make I'll make some Java. What? Oh my precious daughter. Whatever shall we do? Did you just fucking blow up a table? You got it, elf boy. Every time I go to sleep, something blows up. Every time you go to sleep, something blows up? So I don't sleep, which makes me very grumpy. Will you go away? This seems important. It's like that episode of... Okay. Why has this happened to my only daughter? Why? This town seems fucking cursed. Don't mind me, I'm just jumping all of your shit. They're painting, that's a cool detail. The fucking ugh in this music is like destroying my life. It's a lot. The music otherwise is quite, quite nice. 
I just sorted all your boxes. I'm gonna assume boxes are trash in this universe. I hope. Favorite Genesis series of games, hands down, is the Shining series. I did finish Metal Gear Solid, yes. I'm gonna slice the chickens. God, there's so many. I guess I should maybe look at the map. Hello. Oops, sorry. Bonaire. Look at this guy. Dude, did you have a good dream last night? Mine was a most excellent slumber experience, bro. I recall several babes in the skin-type material they call spandex. Okay. What is it, time to eat? Stir the pudding better this time. GG for finishing Metal Gear Solid and beating it. I'm sorry I missed it, stupid work. Oh, don't apologize. Thank you so much, Lord Eric. I really appreciate it, thank you. It was awesome. Stir the pudding better this time. I choked on the lumps in the last one. Yeah, it was um, very strange and a little wild and a lot. I also, I thought it was gonna be longer because Rain gave me like the, hey, this is gonna be too long for you to finish tonight. Oh, you know what? No, I remember why. It's because we had stuff to do like immediately after stream last night. That's why I couldn't go long. What a weird font. Sorry, cheekies. Oh. Tarn's Manor. I've never been there and I don't know anyone who has. All I know is that it's supposed to be a very dangerous place. You aren't going there, are you? Why else would you ask about it? It's a wonderful day outside, but what does it matter to Wendell when he lays at a death's gate? Okay, so I need to leave. Every bird in this game is super loud. Yeah. Makes me wonder if they're going to be super important or something. Alright, let's save and then we'll, we'll head out. Uh, where was I staying? Oh, we haven't been up here. Sorry about your shit. Why are your eyes red? Hello? Oh, it's you. I see the dream, Alundra. From the shadows, the scarlet eyes of the beast stare at the village, at all of us. I really like your house, it's full of herbs. Seems like I can't get money inside. War Song is also really good. Ooh, tactical RPG for Genesis. Yeah, it sounds like the um the volume on the birds is quite loud. <laughs> I think they just want us to uh, to enjoy the birds, appreciate them. For what they are. I don't fucking know. It seems like the mixing is all over the place in this, honestly. Have you met Elenia? Oh, right. Yeah. Ugh. Alright, I need to refine to my house. And by my house, I mean what's his face's house. It's up here. I think it's this. There we go. Yes, Metal Gear has been beaten. Oops. Oh, oops. Hold on. I need to, like, save. And I think we have to do that at the book. He made me promise not to go, but I am going to go. There it is. Yes. <laughs> Examining the parchment. It lets me make multiple saves. I wonder if I should. Maybe not yet. 
I have no idea. Don't tell me if there are, but I have no idea if this is like a multiple ending, you can fuck it up royally type of game, or if it's just like straightforward, do the puzzles stuff. So we'll see. We'll see what we, uh, we come across. Oh, goodness. Actually, I really want to see what my disc looks like, but we'll see. We'll do it later. All right. Let's find out where we're going. Hello? Sethus. So beautiful here, isn't it? Yes. I like to think that my cemetery is a representation of heaven here below. That this place is almost as beautiful for the body as heaven is for the soul. Good lord. Okay, creepy. Alright, so there's like a weird cemetery man. This is a church. It's locked. I can't tell. Am I out in the wilderness? I think I am. The music changed. Magiscar, Inua Village, Coleman. I wonder how I get into fights. Like if there's gonna be... Oh, that's weird. I'm like slowed down. Music reminds you a little of Hook for the SNES. I have not played Hook. Is it Hook like the movie Hook with Robin Williams? That might be a stupid question. It might be completely unrelated. I need to go into a forest to the east. Oh! Hey, you're... Oh, wait. I know. Starts with B, or is it hell? Alundra! Yes, of course you are. I knew that. Nice to meet you. What are you doing here? Don't you know it? there's a coal mine just ahead? It's dangerous. Extremely dangerous. Oops. Oh. He forgot me again. I want to go into the dangerous coal mine. Aww. Wish my grass had a lot of money. Me too. Oh, I didn't even see this. Olin's house? There were hook games based around the movie? That's actually kind of surprising to me. Hello? I'm off to the mine, lad. The sooner I get my work done, the sooner I can come back to Keisha. I wonder if the game takes place like just in this town or... There's so many things that could be happening. I feel like I'm about to be murdered. Herbs obtained. Herbs. Okay. Oh. Refreshes physical strength. Minimum HP. Oh, it's a randomized. Okay. Interesting. What's this? I see. It's to boost me up, maybe. I think this is my first puzzle. Eh? Hmm. 
Interesting. You peer into the chest in hopes of finding something overlooked, but sadly it remains empty. Wait a second. Does that mean sometimes chests will have more things in them? This game has herbs. <laughs> I I know. I'm going to start being obsessed with herbs again. I actually don't know if I have the tools I need to solve this yet, which is interesting. Or maybe I do and my brain is just like garbage. Algae boots. Yes. Remember, you have to live. Choose to live. Thank you, Boots. God, how silly that was. Pretty cute, though. Trials in the sky? Maybe. Probably, eventually. <laughs> Interesting. Ooh. This is so interesting. I can just kind of go wherever I want. Hopefully there's no like time limits. It's a bit weird that I haven't fought anything yet, but I'm sure we'll come to that. Magiscar in a lake. I kind of, I feel like I should have got out the front, but <gasps> oh! There we go! Hi! First enemies! Slimes! Ooh! Gross! They explode too! Holy ravioli! <laughs> Aurora Visage, thank you so much for the raid! Welcome, raiders! <laughs> Holy crap. Thank you very much. I hope you had a good stream. Welcome, everybody. <laughs> uh, the back came 696 and Oki2290. Thank you for following. Thank you, thank you. Welcome, everybody. Um, so, you have pretty good timing. I just, just, just started playing Alundra for PS1, um, which I've never played before, um, which is kind of exciting. Uh, jdog0128 and uzuki7777 <laughs> and savage cues thank you all so much for following welcome everybody welcome welcome i hope you had a good stream friend <laughs> we just finished metal gear solid today and now we we started the lundra which is super exciting and weird three wise was taken <laughs> oh three sevens got it Arrow Hydra, thank you for gifting us up to a rural visage. Thank you very much. We just found our first enemies, they're slimes. This game is so weird. It's like Zelda, but anime, and also... Ow! <laughs> it's just really interesting. Anyway, you're all super welcome here. Um, oh, Backy, thank you as well for the host. Thank you, thank you. I'm trying to get... There we go. I'm learning how to fight. Okay, so the little the little diamonds at the top are my health. Interesting. Looks like Zelda trigger. <laughs> Basically, uh, CDev7, thank you for following. Thank you, thank you. Herbs. Yeah, so we found, um, yeah, it's an action adventure, I guess. I Does it even, I wonder if it... All I know is it's rated T for teen and there's one disc. I don't know. <laughs> we'll figure it out. What's the honking? Oh, sorry. That's that's you. You're doing a button you shouldn't be doing. Yeah, but it's like, um, so far, it's very um, Zelda-like. Ooh, what's this? So I'm kind of just exploring around this village. I was on a ship headed somewhere. Uh, and we crashed 
and all of my shipmates just like died and a guy in a town saved me and that's where we currently are i think that blue dot up there is an enemy see well, this one's purple, but... apparently this game has a lot to do with we as far as i understand we have a special power and we're gonna start going into people's dreams slash brains dream brains we're technically supposed to be on a quest to go find someone to save an old man who can't stop sleeping um but i went a different way oops uh 10 gilder obtained cool uh casey227 thank you for following he saved you so he could infect you with <laughs> a long die. No. So apparently this is going to be a pretty intense puzzle game. Eventually. So it's like a puzzle action adventure with platforming and I don't I don't know. It's it's gonna be a lot. Your dreams suck lately? Well, I will send my boy into your brain and hopefully fix it. Magiscar Holy Keep entrance. I don't think we're supposed to go here. Oh yeah, there's a new poll. Um, our next game, you may choose. It's either going to be Grandia, Illusion of Gaia, or Valkyrie Profile. So if you would like to, feel free to vote in the poll. It's exclamation mark poll. Okay, Austin, I hope you have a good nap. Action venture with platforming is accurate. <laughs> Good. Let's get this. I feel like there's a way to jump higher and I haven't learned it yet. Hell yeah, Alundra one. Yeah, apparently um Alundra won over Brave Fencer Musashi this morning by like one vote. Okami wasn't that far behind either, I don't think. I wonder if I'll get bombs eventually. I can also run. Hey Hez. Anyway, I, d I don't... Ow! I don't... <laughs> Illusion of Grandia is the only right choice? I don't think I can get all this yet, because I definitely came here too early. I assume I'm going to be getting, like, a lot of tools and whatnot. Um, so technically, I'm supposed to be going east to a place called Tarn? Or Torn? But I just kind of went a direction that looked cool because why not even though there's an old man who's dying that i'm supposed to save that's how video games work right okay back to the town let's go out the front instead the Torin republic no he's not dead he's probably fine maybe all right in Noah is the name of the town we're in. Also, I have a map of this town and like little bios of everybody from the map that came with the game. Pretty cool. The fuck was that? Sound like a bear. Old man would be th fine. B? Hi. Are you gonna hurt me? Or are we friends? Ow! Mm. Oh, I see. There's like verticality to you? Octavia, please don't fuck up my camera anymore. I hear a... Maybe it's just the bees I hear. It sounds like a bear. No village. Beach. What is that? It's like someone burping or something. Or maybe it's the bee, I don't know. Everything explodes when you kill it. Maybe the bee is burping on me. Is this what happened? What is that? Hello? Okay, so those little pips are health. The infamous burping bee? Yeah. I think it is the bees. How upsetting. Get 
They just make the worst sounds when they die. Do you explode? I maybe. Killing bees first the dog, that was not enough. I didn't kill the dog. I tried to pet the dog, but my only button to interact is sword. What was that sound? Oh, hello. I'm headed for the coal mine. Yes, it's... Oh! Shit, sorry guy. I'm headed for the coal mine. Yes, it's hard work, but the dental plan is second to none. Hi, turtle. <gasps> cool. Can I even kill you? Hey, Shadow! Yes, Metal Gear Solid has been defeated. This is cool! Beach, Novice Cabin. This cabin. Yeah, that game actually, I thought it was going to be super long because it was two discs, because it, was, it wasn't long at all. I need a bigger dagger, or like a sword, I should say. Hey, Mr. Frips! Yeah, I'm I'm super excited. I um I had never heard of this game. Rain and I have just had it forever. Um I think it was given to him by someone um, when he used to work at GameStop. Um and um I, I was cataloging all of our games, like taking pictures of them and such, um, to ensure them. And I got really kind of like enamored with how this game looked, um, the case and everything, because I had to take it all apart and take pictures. And I was like, wow, this is gorgeous. Oh, Arrow Hydra, thank you for gifting us up to Shadow. Thank you, thank you. But it's really gorgeous. Yeah, um, so GameStop wasn't accepting um, older games at the time, and this guy came in with, like, a huge box of PS1 games. And he was like, I'm sorry, we can't, we can't accept this. And he was like, look, man, I'm just gonna leave it here. Like, where's, where's your car? I'll just leave it there. So he left a, a, a box full, so we have, like, a closed PS, uh, Persona 2. Um, we have, like, we were given a Lundra, um... Yeah, I don't know. It, it was like the luckiest day. For some reason. Um, yeah. Oh, happy early birthday, Shadow! And congratulations! I'm so glad you're getting your first vaccine. I'm hopefully getting mine Friday, so... Um, but yeah, we got really, really lucky. Um, some, some guy just like... G gave, gave them away. Scar, the one on your forehead, it's... Oh, never mind. Hear this and understand what I say. For your sake and the sake of the others, you must leave. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I think it's one of the only good things that happened to him when he was there. Look. I'd like your treasure, sir. This music's interesting. What? Why is this so fucking good? Okay. Damn. Who made this? Glad to see Illusion of Gaia winning a pull. Yes! I have Illusion of Gaia because Shadow uh, told me about a really good deal on eBay. A year ago. 
Oh, I can't go into this. This is burping bees again. So I think it's the turtle. Yes, oh, there you are. Get out. Oh, it's hard to move in sand! Alright, so terrain's gonna be a big thing. Warning, no lifeguard on duty! That's fucking funny. Apparently this composer did the music for a lot of anime. But just a handful of gate. Wah! Mm. Fuck you. Just got hit by a fish. Poor turtle chilling out on the beach and I <laughs> here comes me. Hey Zarin. First of all, the turtle was burping very loudly. And ruining everyone's time. my excuse. I can't jump this high when I'm on sand. Can I jump on you? Ow. Why did I do that? Nope. <gasps> I'm gonna die! <laughs> I fucked around too much. Well, I guess we get to see what happens when we die. Quick restart. Cool. Yeah, this is karma. I deserve this. <laughs> I gotta die eventually. <gasps> you lose everything? Oh, this is like a full... Alright. There goes everything I just did. Alright, that's fine. I learned my lesson. We'll be more careful. We came back after we talked to everyone, at least. Yeah, apparently saving's important. It's all right, I can do that stuff again. That's what I get for dicking around. I was too busy, like, learning, learning the, the quirks. He composed the music for Gundam 08. THMS team, which is one of your favorite soundtracks. I mean, we knew there was nothing up here, but at the same time, I'm like... I don't know if me going up here actually mattered. Because we were able to get a treasure out of here. Hmm. This game's overall fantastic. Good. That's fine. Going back to the last save is how they normally are, so... I forgot I had that herb. I'm gonna have to double check chests. I don't- the way that it does that message makes me suspicious. Yeah, I'm really digging the music so far. The controls are interesting too. Looks like before this game, the guy composed for three other games and like 25 anime. Cool. Yeah, there are definitely more anime influences on this game than most of the games I normally play, so. Off to the mine. Okay. We already talked to these people, but I don't know. I have no idea if there's, like, triggers for certain conversations or... Ooh. I'm gonna pick it up anyway. This is fine. We're just exploring and learning. Perfect ending rip, you think? Yeah, there might be triggers for talking to people. So just in case, we'll just do it faster. Those- oh, everyone has cool wings! That's neat. <sighs> don't trust him, his name is Lie Man. This is a Darth Bond, I don't think he's going to lie to me just because of his name, but you never know. Hey Octavia! Ooh, it's lunchtime, but I'm gonna explore a little bit more, and then I'll go get a snack. I'm so excited that we're playing this game. I can't tell you. It's like, uh, it's like when you're a kid, and you see a game in the store, you just see its cover, and you've never heard about it. But for some reason, it, like, you keep thinking about it. That's how this game is to me since I found it in our collection. And I was just like, what the hell is this? I'm so excited. 
All right, growly bees. Fuck right off. Look, I'm already getting better at fighting. Nothing about it, but good cover art does a lot for me. Right? You vote you voted for it just because of my cover. See? That's what happened to Grandia for you. Right! Grandia looks so cool! I'm so excited. There's so many games for us to play still, and I'm, I'm just like. I was worried when I started streaming that we would run out of games in less than a year, but look at us. A year in whatever in, and there's still so many more. House for sale. Contact Centurius. 21st? It's locked. I want it. Tactic saved you in time. True. Both of them did, basically. We've been playing a lot of really long games this year, too. Sorry if the jumping's annoying. I really enjoy jumping in games. I don't... I could play this like it was, um, Cadence of Pyrrhal. Jump, slash, jump, slash, slash. <laughs> kind of the same with Star Ocean 2, but from the other angle. I loved how the cover of the game told me nothing about it. Love me so intrigued. <laughs> Centurious 21, what a dumb joke. I don't get it. Is my brain burn? It's not 20th Century Fox, is it? Why am I thinking of that? Alright, I want to go to whoever's cabin that is. Fuck you, turtle! Ooh! He didn't turn. Ow! Too many turtles. It's interesting how strong my pushback is. <gasps> Big coin! Alright, doing better. I want that, but I can't get in there. Century 21 is a real estate company? Oh! Yeah. I think I would know that. Can't wait for you to get to Breath of Fire 3. Oh, I'm so excited. I do have to get a copy, but it'll be fun. I'll get it. See, so many games to play. Moku. <laughs> I'm an unwilling expert in real estate. We didn't use that company, so I don't. Uh, I don't know who they are. Should we be keeping score again for me versus turtles? No, thank you. All right. This guy is super ominous and wants me to leave. But I'm pretty sure that I'm here to help them. Because hopefully I'll be able to go... Okay, this is where I died before. Fuck you! We'll just be more careful. I was trying to get double hits in this poopy bad sand, so... Yeah, see? My jump is, like, halved here, and my speed is all slippery. It's not really how sand works, but... I mean, I guess it could, depending how, like, deep and fine the sand is. I just walked into that one. Yeah, I was trying to test to see if I could jump on their heads. That's absolutely how sand works. I guess. I don't remember being this bad, but again, I haven't been to the beach in, like long ass time. Maybe like five years now? What was this weird beach? Southern Cali beaches are just like that? Really? <laughs> okay, so everything respawns when you leave the... Or what's the word for it? Like the... Screen? I'm supposed to be going into a forest. To the east. I assume that's this. Okay. 
Headed for the coal mine. Right. Maybe I need to learn how to break a rock. Ow! Break a stone. Can you burn that for me? Just not like it. Especially with your Kingdom Hearts boots. Yeah. Technically, this came out before Kingdom Hearts, so. Maybe they're Are you stunned? <laughs> Thank you for the bit test. I just said Hest. Hessian. I'm not st I'm not stumped. I'm gonna solve this. So I'm gonna go. Let's save. Again, lives in Portland for about six months now after living in San Diego my whole life. Not being near the coast at all times is, yeah, text I'm getting used to mentally. I agree with you. I lived pretty close to the coast, on, or the East Coast. Um, but it's like two to three hours, depending on, you know, traffic and stuff, to get to the beach from here. That's so weird. Don't think I've ever lived more than an hour from the beach on either coast. <gasps> Tar there we go. Tarn's Manor. Dark Swamp. Wait, this isn't east. Whatever. We finally went the right way, I think. More herbs. I said I was gonna save. Hold on, let's run back and save because I don't want to do all that again. I think I have to go north. I think jumping is faster. I honestly can't tell. <laughs> Never lived far from a beach when you were in Florida. I mean, that's kind of the way that Florida is, yeah. My grandparents lived in Florida when I was little. And the first time I ever went was to visit them. And I remember how so warm the beach was. It was really surprising. Granted, you know, New England beaches aren't that cold. Depends on the time of year, obviously, but... Hey, beaches in Florida? My issue is that they're full of cigarette butts. At least they were in the early 90s, or the mid to late 90s. Alright. Save. Yes. Cali beaches are better. Not as hard as you think. There's parts of Florida where you have to drive a few hours to the nearest beach. Mm -hmm. Alright, I think we'll make two saves. And like, scoot between them maybe. I still don't know if there's like some soft blocking bullshit in this game or not. Considering Every game we've been playing has had some funky stuff with saves. We shall see. Oops. Here in Florida. Wait, beaches here in Florida are flat? They all look the same? Warm water is weird? Really? I find the West Coast really stinky and cold compared to East Coast beaches. Yeah. East Coast, Best Coast. Uh. Oh my god, is that this character? Good lord. That's such a cute little sword friend. Alright, so let's go up from here. 
We saved. I feel more confident now. Oh, right. Double checking chests. I feel like that's a thing that I should do because it's giving me a funky message. Time of chaos. Thank you for following. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. Maybe the protect is hungry. Oh, you mean the grumbly sound? Whoa. That guy looks like he'd fuck me up. All right, well, we're not going into the poopy swamp. We're going here. Huh? Hmm. Go say hi to him? I don't know how. We might have to, actually, because if I can't find a way up here. Oh, wait. This game is so different than I was expecting. Warning, fallen tree ahead, path to despair, desert closed. Good, I don't want to go there. It sounds bad. It's like Bramble was up there. I wonder if I can ever run into things to make stuff happen. Despair Desert sounds lovely. It sounds like something from a um, <laughs> uh, series of unfortunate events. Oh, wow. Big, big guys. Tarn's Manor, danger do not enter. This is where we're headed. Well, a small boy never says no to danger. Were those orcs? I think they were. Can't wait to go. Yeah, that looks like an orc to me. Look, there's more of that, like, ramble. Can't break it. <gasps> <gasps> Ow! Hey! Okay, they didn't actually take damage from me. I just got snacked by some monkeys. I fucking hate monkeys. <gasps> oh, I want that treasure. All right, well, plot monkeys? I guess so. Monkers, lizard, lizard mans, orcs, good game. Tarn's Manor. All right, this is our first challenge. Oh, I'm being cutscene. Oh shit, it's this guy, uh, Mil Mils. Those in full command of their mental faculties will heed the course of wisdom, stay away. Well, I'm an idiot, so, oh, my doors. <gasps> oh, they've got like Vega claws. Oh cool, I get to kill monkeys in this game? It's pretty neat. Get out of here. I took their monkey money. Fuck, this game is so cool. Rogue stands. Yeah. Oh, it's that music again. Dude, is this game like incredible? Strength tonic obtained. Recovers up to half max HP. Minimum HP recovered is 10. Cool. Never listened to this with headphones. OST is better than open speakers. Yeah, this is really good. Doesn't okay, when I throw this, it sounds like someone going with their mouth.
Yeah, the sound design for this game is interesting. <gasps> Congratulations, bees! We're getting it on the same day. the shadow it's just the shadow oh In love with this. This game is incredible. <gasps> Whoa, ew! Did you see that? I don't know if it's like in parts of Luvia 2 where you have to kill everything in the room and it causes something that happens. That's what I'm that's what I'm testing. This is so fucking cool. Looks like there's stuff under those. It's just the, the water effect. Ah! There's a way to put things down directly at your feet. I think so. I think I have to toss. I'll get used to it. I'll get used to it. I wonder if- Oh! That was really lucky. Gilded Falcon? What? Is that a- Eh? Or to... I don't know what that was. Okay.
Interesting. What's this? That's what that is. Okay. I wonder if I should use one of those. No, we should wait until we're lower. <gasps> it goes the other way! Ow, okay, we're lower. Try to use one. Oh, I see. And now it's cool. Okay, I want to take that off actually. Oh, I can't. Okay, crud. Because I'm totally going to hit that button by accident. Yeah, my luck today is on point. Oh, crud. Hold on. One second. Okay, sorry about that. Our appraisal finally came in. And it didn't come in low! Fucking good ass good news. Oh, this is a. So I think, uh. I think we're good. I think that was the last thing we were waiting for in this house, so. I think we are all set now. I hope. <laughs> Unless some magical shit comes in. It's incredibly good news. Um, because if our... If you're... Oh wow, it doesn't let me heal. Okay. If your appraisal comes... If the appraisal had come in low, we might have to, like, cover the gap. Because, I don't know, it's a bunch of... It's a bunch of garbage. Anyway. Um, it did not. It came in, like, exactly what we paid, which is perfect. Are you gonna buy us dinner? Oh, I'm not getting any money. It's just that, um... We, uh, we don't have to worry about the... Ow! Our loan... Us not getting the loan now. Oh, I just have to hit them once! Okay! Pizza party? God, that'd be so cool. I wish we could do that. There we go. Haha! -ha! <gasps> Key obtained. Mm. Does that feel like there'd be a secret in here? Oh, the door. Ba -ba 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 
Ba, 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 ba. Thank you, Mr. Jawbones. I hope you have a good day at work. Oh. Life vessel obtained. This seems important. Oh, cool! More health. I've got to buy that one in the store then. <laughs> Remember pizza parties? The thing companies do when they need you for unpaid overtime. Good lord, you're right. Oh, that pops out from this store. Okay. I wonder if I should go back and save. It took me so long to get here, though. Unfortunately, it gave me the health, but it didn't fill it up. Actually, I don't know if I can leave. Oh, I can. Took away our extra COVID pay. They said they would get us barbecue and Hawaiian theme party instead. Wow, what a wonderful thing to do. It's terrible. I'm gonna go back and save. No, I'm not. Am I? I'm gonna farm some health, though. Wait. Did that not go in? <gasps> oh! That was one single little bip. Okay, so all of that is not available to me. My work used to have a pizza party when they wanted to distract you while they explained that they weren't do it, going to address any employee concerns and complaints. Jesus fucking Christ. All right. They were like, Rezo, you can't leave yet. And I'd say, no, you can't leave yet. And they'd, they'd laugh and walk out. I used to have jobs that tried to make me do unpaid overtime. My my last job luckily paid. Hello. Can I throw boxes at you? Shitty monkeys. Do it. Do it. Do it. Monkey. Okay. Do it. Ow. Okay, I think I understand the health now. Boulders? I used my healing herb. I knew that was going to happen. Alright, I guess I made up for it. <gasps> 30 Gilder. I was just jumping on the table. Stupid. Book of Elma. Guidebook found in Tarn's Manor. Can I select it? No. Interesting. Don't stand on tables. Well, apparently standing on the table was a good thing, because it got me this cool book. Uh-oh. Hi. I am Melzas, ruler of this wretched land. Those foolish enough to dabble in the affairs of my subjects shall pay the ultimate price. Um. I'm gonna jump on your table, you big bully. I like the music in your manner, though. It's pretty fucking good. I don't think I can... Nope, that didn't work. No, I can't select it. <gasps> Whip! Hey, guys. 
jerks. Excuse me. What? Unbelievable. Alundra got slime jelly on the table. I guess so. Happy to experience this. Aw, oh, thank you, King Smash. Me too. I... Huh? I'm really glad that we're playing this. I guess I didn't really understand what to expect, but this is way cooler than I was expecting. I guess... I mean... I don't know who... I, I thought I was supposed to get his former teacher, but maybe the book is enough? There doesn't seem to be anything else in here, so... Monkey Butlers! You probably were a good worker, Rezo. I would believe that. You were a freshman in high school when you played this game? Alright, let's find our way back. We'll save. And... We will... Drop off this book, hopefully. Hmm? What's down here? Wait, isn't this a yucky marsh? Oh, we've been here. Yeah, Inoa Village. This is where we have to go. Wouldn't it be funny if the ultimate price was, like, the last slice of pizza? He's not really... <laughs> Guy. Oh, that was so much closer than I thought. I just didn't know where it was. It's interesting. <sighs> Alright, let's go save, and then we'll drop off the book. Unfortunately, I don't remember where it goes, but um, I always have that map we can look at that came with it. Yes. I need to buy the other health blip at the store. So we're just gonna go basically in any everywhere. Sage, welcome. Yeah, I've never played this before, so I'm having a really good time. Uh, T Drub, thank you for following. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I am playing this uh, <laughs> uh, in the music, but um, I'm playing this for the first time. Uh, and I'm doing it what we used to call blind. So, no help. No looking anything up. Unless, like, it's in the manual. Manual's fair game, because I have it. Alright, that's the assholes. All right, let's see. I don't remember which place is a shop. Uh, Andwer Base, thank you so much for subbing with Prime. Thank you, thank you. Holy shit. Welcome. I hope you enjoy your emotes. Locked. <laughs> ah, um, my schedule is, yeah, Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to to 5 p.m. Pacific time. Why'd you turn around? You were attacked by white monkeys. Where? Tarn's house? Hmm. They sound like Merg. But those foul beasts reside in a dark forest far to the northwest of here. With all the dangerous monsters about, I wouldn't be caught without herbs. I have those now. Cool! Everybody has, like, unique things to say. Ah! Oh, you played through this game? It's kind of I know! It definitely is a hidden gem so far. Ah! Oh. I want this. Lip, pick it up. Ew. A life vessel? Ah, oh, Sage91, thank you for following as well. I really appreciate that. 500? 500. And she doesn't want to sell me the other thing. What's this? Yeah. A magic elixir? <laughs> Why? For 30 Gilder, it can be put to work to make all your dreams come true. Uh, Starla, thank you for following. Thank you, thank you. Oh yeah, Friday, Friday I'm gonna start a little late because I'm getting my first COVID shot. Which is exciting. Don't know that it was that hidden. That's fair. I guess 
No one's ever recommended it to me. I just put it on a pole because I owned it. So I would say it was hidden in that respect. I guess lesser known is probably the better, better word. I don't know. Everything's fucking relative, man. That goes up into that zone. All right. I have this ding dang book now. I think this. It's like up. Not. The house to the left is where the old man is, and then up more, I think, is where the person is. Olin asked if I would meet him at the beach at dusk. I think I will. Ooh. I remember when Wendell told me that he didn't believe in the gods. His heresy went like this. The gods were invented by men too weak to accept the harsh realities of a harsh life alone. Do you think he believes in the gods now, Alundra? Whoa! Never met anyone in real life who played it. Huh. Small part of this tune just reminds you of Wii Sports. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to get the soundtrack. Gonna try to get the one dose shot of this weekend. Oh, here we go. Uh, help me, says Wendell. Oh, Grandpa, if you die, I'll certainly die too. Septimus, please help my Grandpa. You're the only one who can save him. Despite my having prayed at the Shrine of Magiscar, there was no change. I can't believe that all that prayer did no good. Perhaps I wasn't sincere enough. Uh, Alundra, you've returned. And you brought a book! Septimus is handed a tome. <laughs> is handed? That's interesting. I see. Alundra, you are of the clan of Elna, the Dreamwalkers. You have the power to enter the dreams of other people and change their outcome. You can use this power to rescue Wendell from his disabling nightmare. Cool. You must go to him at once. I'll keep reading as you attempt to enter his dream. To assist you. Are you ready, Alundra? Take Wendell's wrist gently in your hand. There, that's it. Now concentrate. Try to feel his heartbeat pulse beneath your fingertips. Listen to the rise and fall of his breath, Alundra. Try to breathe in time with him. Inhale, exhale. In, out. In, out. In. Do you feel the flow, Alundra? Are you ready to make the leap? I mean, I just saved, didn't I? Yeah! Wendell's dream. Fuck! Hello? Help, please help me. Hello? Oh no. It's okay, old man. I'll save you from the pretty slimes. Please, deliver me! Help me, someone, anyone! I'll help you. I feel like I can fall off of this. Herb? That's so strange, you'd think... Can I fall off? Oh, I can't. Okay, I've been like... Trying to be careful because I felt that I could fall off. Oh. 
God, this music's fucking creepy. Music sounds like a murderous clown hiding behind the corner. Yeah, it does. Oh. I just got cutscened? No! There was stuff in here! Oh shit. If you die in the dream, do you die in real life? I'm gonna assume so, yeah. Oh. It's side based. It's a trigger. It's a trigger? It's a trigger. I just got really lucky. I have to go all the way in the bottom. Got it. That's cool! Got it. Oh, thank the gods! You've come at last! Whew. Stop screaming! Wh who are you? Alondre, oh, please tell me you've come to release me from this horrid nightmare. I have. Oh, jeez. At least I think I have. Uh-oh. Um. Oh my god. Ugh! Oof! Hello, iframes! I get stuck on the old man! Sorry, I'm pushing this into you, sir. This thing is so fucking cool looking.
thing? Man, I got touched. Oh boy. Okay. Alright. Let's just iframe our way through. the first boss fight. Gelatinoid has been defeated. Da -da! Cool. Oh, thunderation! That was some of the finest swordsmanship I've ever witnessed. Thank you. Fuck, I want that emo now. Ugh. Huh? Where'd he go? Sir? Alundra, can you hear me? It is I, Septimus. Wendell's body has stopped tensing, and he's not moaning anymore. In fact, he appears to be smiling. I don't know what you did, but his nightmare is definitely over. First dream save. <sighs> You're back now? It was so strange. When you entered Wendell's dream, your body went slack. If I hadn't steadied you, you certainly would have fallen to the floor. When you exited the dream, your body appeared to reanimate. It was quite a sight to behold. There's no need to be concerned, Mead. It appears that that is to be the norm when he enters other streams. I understand what you're saying, but it still gives me the shivers. I'm grateful, but I don't have to like it. Oh, where am I? What, what in tarnation is going on? Yeah, back to uh, uh. <laughs> Just chased. Oh, <gasps> Lucy escaped. Oh, did you get her back? Jesus Christ, that's terrifying. Fucking Parchibas. Oh, God damn it. I missed what they said. Can someone explain what in Hades I'm doing in a bed at this hour? Don't you remember, Father? You've been asleep for the past three days, trapped in a terrible nightmare. But you're okay now. You're awake and even more importantly, alive. I remember now, I was being chased by a foul, horrid creature of pure evil. No matter where I fled in that terrible world, the beast found me. At last, I fell to the ground, too exhausted to continue the cruel charade. A charade. When I struggled to my feet to face my end, I saw the glorious face of Alundra and my salvation. Grandpa knows Alundra's name. He couldn't have known that unless Alundra really went into his dream. How cool is that? That is cool. This game's fucking cool. Oh no. <laughs> the dog just fell off a cliff. Wendell has survived. Praise the gods. I must report this wonderful news to Chancellor Ronan at once. Alundra's a witch? Burn him! We got her, but she's grounded. Well then, Alundra, I guess it's time we left Wendell alone for some much-needed rest. <laughs> he needs the opposite of rest. Come, return with me to my home and I'll explain your powers in greater detail. Yes! While you were gone, I uncovered some fascinating things about your gift. Septimus? Alundra? Thank you so much for saving Grandpa. Oh, I'm gonna love this game. Ugh. Greetings, Alundra. 
Chancellor Ronan has requested an audience with you and sent me to fetch you, Alundra. If you could come with me to the sanctuary to meet him, he'd most he'd be most appreciative, I'm certain. Ronan wants to speak with you. That's certainly strange. But you better see what he wants. I'm certain he'll be pleased to learn that Wendell's all right. Tell you what, Alundra. After you and he have spoken, meet me back here at my home so we can discuss your powers at length. Follow me to the sanctuary if you would, Alundra. I I'd really like to say first... Some money would have been nice. Dream adventures are cheap. Huh? Why are we going up here? This way. This doesn't seem right. Oh. This place was locked before, I think. I did, capitalistic. I saved an old man. Oh my. Hello. <laughs> Look at you. Yes, I know, Alundra. Wendell has survived. The gods held forth a thread of salvation for his soul. Let us pray to the gods and thank them for their undeserved benevolence. No. Have you no respect for the powers of salvation? On your knees. Let us pray to the gods and thank them for the undeserved kindness they have extended. I hate religion. No. Have you... Do I have to? On your knees! No! I reject your gods. Fine! I guess I must. Fine. It's God in a JRPG. It's gonna be fucking evil, man. I don't... Look at the design on that. That's so cool. You see, the gods do exist. They exist in the hearts and minds of those that pray dearly to them. Why am I here? Huh. Now you're one with us, my friend. You shall become just as we. No better, no worse. Uh, Matteo Laron, maybe? I'm sorry if I said that wrong. Thank you for following. Welcome. Ah, uh, did I say, uh, Storolov? I think I missed you. If I did, I'm so sorry. Thank you for following as well. I'll pray, but I won't mean it. Exactly. I'll pray, but I don't... I don't believe in any of this garbage. I, I, look. You can believe in whatever you want. That's fine. But you don't make other people do it. Especially in a JRPG where it's probably going to come kill a town. huge. <gasps> what? Whoa. Praise be to Yevon. Exactly, Chrono. Why doesn't your church have chair puzzles? Tell your pastor or whatever. Maybe they'll make some. Well, that was interesting. I don't know how to solve it yet, but... Yeah, the dragon god was a good god. There can be good gods. But JRPG gods. Gotta watch out for them. Sometimes they're just demons. This place is full of tricks! Oh, my eyes are bothering me. Actually, I should take a quick break. Um, it's been like five hours and I haven't stepped away from my computer like at all. Granted, not five hours of one game, but still. Oh, 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 oh! Tricks are for kids? <laughs> Wait, is this the... Aha! No, this is different. That is a... What is that? A furnace? Even this music is less horrendous than most of the, like, church music we've heard in games recently. 
be the chair puzzle you want to see in the world. Fantastic. What a wonderful message that is. Choose life. Friends, choose to live. <laughs> Ooh, locked. Ooh. Hmm. There's gotta be like a higher jump or something I'm gonna get eventually. Yeah, we're gonna have to come here. Come back here at some point and like fucking loot this shit out of it. Alright, I don't really understand the point of this, but... <sighs> I still don't have enough money either. This is the music Psycho Mantis is playing? Maybe. I'm so tempted to like grind up 500, but I'm sure I'll have enough. Hey, little asshole. Listen, peasant, I'm- huh? You did what? You went to the creepy manor that used to be Tarn- Tarns? I hate to admit this, but that's pretty cool. Even for a peasant. Oh, am I gaining the respect of the village? If this village is like my fucking hub and I just get to explore further out, this is gonna be like the coolest shit. I hope that's the case. What? Have your senses left you? Why would you want to go to Tarn Spooky Manor alone? Oh, hey, that bump on your head must have mixed you up more than I guessed. Your body's healed. I think that head of yours is still broken. I already did it, butthole, and it was fine. He totally wants to be my dad. Gain the respect of an asshole, kid. Isn't that really all of our lives' goals? To gain the respect of one asshole, kid? <laughs> I, there's a kid that lives across the street that I saw we were uh, doing some stuff to our new house. I can't believe I'm saying our new house. I really think that we're okay now, so I'm going to start letting myself say it. And I hope he's an asshole, and I hope to gain his respect. It's a goal I have. Anyway, holy ravioli, thank you all so much for being here. I'm going to take a quick break. We still have two hours left in stream. Uh, so I'm going to get a snack uh, and probably some more water. Uh, thank you so much for being here. If you are new, feel free to drop a follow. Um, if you would like to talk about spoilers, we do have a companion chat to this one in our Discord. Exclamation mark Discord will get you a link. It's called Spoil City. Um, that is a place you can, you know, complain about how I miss things or I'm doing it all wrong or, you know, be like, wow. I can't believe she figured that one out. No, you'd say that here. Anyway. <laughs> um, also vote in the poll for a new game game after this is either going to be Grandia, Illusion of Gaia, or Valkyrie Profile, all of which I'm very excited about. Okay, I'll be right back. Stretch your bods, get a drink, eat a snack. Uh, hi. One second. There we go. Now I'll be right back. <laughs>
<laughs> hey, I'm back. Thank you for waiting for me. I just shove, shove a bunch of chips in my milk. <sighs> I hope your Tuesday is going well. I really hope. I, we still have to have a phone call with our realtor, but I'm like, I can't believe the news we just got. Hopefully it's super, super good. Um, back on my lunch bullshit. Rain is in the middle of a phone call or a work call, and I like don't know what we have in the house right now because <laughs> we're supposed to be making pizza for dinner, so I just ate a bunch of chips. Don't judge me. I'll honk at you. <laughs> anyway. I was making sausage and peppers. <gasps> oh, I haven't had anything like that in like a fucking decade and a half. Aw, oh, thank you, bees. That is very sweet of you. I am very thankful for all of you. <laughs> Ugh. I love this music. All right. So, ooh, my eyes twitching. Rain just made like the loudest. Anyway, oh, they took my book. All right, let's go back to um, our new friend. Are you a veggie? Uh, I was a veggie until 2020, and then I started trying to eat some meats. Uh, I'm kind of back to being mostly full veggie now. Um, yeah, I was a vegetarian for 10 years, and um, I still really don't enjoy meat very much, but I'm trying to eat it so I don't, you know. I'm trying to get used to eating it still. Some things are fine. Um, I hate chicken though. Yeah, Beyond Meat sausages are really good. So are, um, uh, I really like, um, Morningstar has like these little patties that are pretty good and they have like tiny breakfast sausages too, if I'm remembering the brand correctly. Eating a handful of pizza flavored Pringles. Yes, Chips King. Hey, Arjen. Uh, I don't know what was ahead. All I know is that when I finished, this was ahead by one, so that's what we're playing. Alright, I think he's here. I know, I'll jump all the time. <clears throat> Alundra, I have news for you. Please come near. Near? Uh, Warlock of the Zor, thank you for following. Thank you very much. Wendell is not alone in his affliction of cursed dreams. There's a girl named Sybil who dreams though she's awake. Ah, oh, the creepy girl. She claims that in her dreams she sees events that have yet to occur. Nadia is another. Wait. Okay. Yeah, Nibble who. Uh, nib, nibble! Nibble! <laughs> I mix Nadia and Sybil. So, Sybil it has awake dreams. And if Nadia falls asleep, she fucking blows shit up. So, that's interesting. Alundra's a freaking. <laughs> Recently, finally, you don't have to bake chicken, so you like it. See, I don't know why, but um, a couple years into being a vegetarian, now whenever I try to eat, or like when I'm around chicken, I can like smell it. I don't know. I just... And I know it's like, oh, that's only if chicken goes bad, you can smell it. No, like... Ugh, it doesn't matter. This is pointless. You can totally eat chicken if you want. I just have like a weird smell issue with it right now and I'm trying to fight it and I don't know how to make it go away. <clears throat> Nadia is another. She sleeps and strange events occur. Nearby objects explode if packed with, as if packed with dynamite. Oh, I thought they were saying that. Mm, well, of course. I'm told that she's not slept in days and tears near insanity. I journeyed here three long years ago. I had heard tales of a village cursed by eerie happenings. I believed I could determine the cause of the madness. But all I've ascertained thus far is the limits of my ability. But now that you've come, everything has changed. You hold the power to stop the nightmares, Alundra. I've witnessed your might in combating the evil, and I envy you. Alundra, with your power and my knowledge, we can save the good people of Anoa. We can find the source of the evil nightmares and we can banish it to the eternal prison of history. This is so well written, holy shit. You can smell fresh chicken too. It has a distinct foul smell, Magus. Fuck. I read it. 
Mask it with barbecue sauce. So far, the only things I enjoy eating, and this is wild, are meatballs, because my husband makes the meatballs with the recipe I had as a kid. So like spaghetti meatballs. And like steak or lamb. Just like steaks of, of it. Everything else, fucking leave it. <laughs> I don't know why. Everything else I'd rather just eat vegetarian. I have an incredible, okay. Look up the, um, I'll send you my meatball recipe. Asking food in Discord. What the fuck? Actually, I'll just tell you, it's Dom DeLuise's meatball recipe. Look it up, it's amazing. Feels like an earthquake. Oh, this is terrible, awful. It's collapsed? The freaking coal mine is collapsed. The coal mine? Let's go, Alundra, perhaps we can help. He's like, hmm, thinking as he runs. Wait, can I have this? I guess it's my book, huh? Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, Dom DeLuise, I think he calls it his, his mom's meatballs. It's the meatball recipe I've been having since I was a kid, and even Rain has forgotten his family recipe for it. It's fucking incredible. If the coal mine collapsed, I fear there may be poor souls trapped within. We must do whatever lies within our means to get them out, Alundra. Olin is the sole survivor of the cave-in, but he's only just barely alive. He's been taken to the mayor's house. How did that happen so fast? There could be more people alive. Wait, the mayor's house? Turn around. Why is this taking so long to load? Jesus. Hey, Neko Wolf. It is fun so far. My sister would be devastated if Olin were to pass away. <gasps> oh, right. But his fate now rests and has always rested in the hands of the gods. No, it doesn't. Olin's a bright one, you know what I'm saying? But he's barely alive. Did he not have time to warn the others before he escaped? I wonder. Wait. <gasps> it's locked! I can't save. Okay. Be calm, my sweet. I don't believe Alundra is accusing you of anything, are you, lad? I thought not. Oh no, of course I wasn't. No, I was not sleeping, elf boy. What are you implying? That I caused the coal mine to collapse? Well, you're wrong. And how dare you accuse me of causing something so terrible to happen? This poor fucking girl, she hasn't slept in days. I heard a thunderous roar from afar. Are the gods trying to speak to us? You people are too religious. Dude, did you feel the most righteous earthquake? What, bro? The mine collapsed. I have a most uneasy feeling that Olan and the others in the mine got worked and good. I hate this fucking dude. <gasps> so I just scare a chicken? Alright, let's go check. I really don't like um, riding in a surfer. The fucking idiot priest is here. If he doesn't improve soon, this child won't survive through the night. I don't, oh, Beaumont. Olin and the others are experts at their work. But could one of them have caused this accident? What shall I do? I just have no idea is the best course of action. Why have the gods done this to Olin? A kinder man does not walk this land. Ugh. Ugh. Help! Help! Ugh. Yes, yes, yes! Can I fix him? By the gods. Klein has given me interesting news, Alundra. Hmm? He said that when Olin was brought into town just before he passed out, he whispered the word Merg. <gasps> the monkey people! Did you say Merg? How is it that we have heard had the misfortune of crossing those devilish monkeys from the tree? <laughs> and it's even more curious that they've attacked humans. They usually don't do that. The coal mine is near the area where the Merg live. It's quite possible their work disturbed them. Can you imagine the horror of Zane and the others? Hearing the low rumble of the roof about to cave in. Having just enough time to realize what's about to happen. And then... Buried alive. Suffocating under tons of damp, pungent soil. Dude! Whoa! Relax! But why would the Merg react so violently in the first place as to cause such a terrible thing? If 
we try to rescue Zane and the others, the Merg might attack again. How can I justify risking lives to save lives? But we can't just wait for it to happen. Alundra, I think we both know what must be done. There's only one way to learn what happened at the mine. You must enter Olin's mind. You have to explore his dream or whatever state he is experiencing. But remember, this world of caution. This word of caution. If Olin should perish while you yet inhabit his unconscious, you will surely perish as well? Um, no! I would have liked to say first. Olin's nightmare. He used to have an uncle. Okay, I'm just gonna go because I don't know if there's a time limit. It's a vehicle driven solely by the power of steam. Amazing, isn't it? Of course, it's completely my idea. I'm not as dense as I appear, but actually a genius. Hey there, Alundra. Would you go tell Zane to start the engine? I think he's in the back room. Hello there, Alundra. You've come just in time to help us expand this tunnel. We're pretty sure that the northwest of here is... There's tons of rich coal. Of course, digging in that direction will put us near the big tree the Merg inhabit, but... Well, that's what fucking... Olin wants me to start the engine. Why didn't he come tell me himself? Fine, boy, I'll do as you say. But I'll talk to Olin about his choice of messenger later. Who took my place, then? All you have to do is throw the levers to the left. Oh, left. Left. Right and left. You can remember that, can't you? Or is it too difficult for your tiny elf brain? Must be hard to have a tiny elf brain and not be crushed under tons of damn soil. Check it out, Alundra. I finally got a mining bomb. With this baby, I'll be able to smash through stone like nobody's business. Stick around and maybe you can see it in action. Okay. What the? It's Merg. What are they doing here? Ow, hey! Great. I love being stuck in corner. Oh my god, I think they're- Alundra, can you hear me? Olin is very badly hurt, you must hurry. Return to us soon. What? Did I fucking fail? Alundra, are you alright? What did you find at the mine? Well, where? Were there Merg? What did you say? Oland and the others were attacked by the Merg. They dug a tunnel into our mine, but why? I'm certain that the mine shaft collapsed because of the Merg. I never imagined the Merg were clever enough to dig tunnels, let alone ambush. They dug a tunnel into our mine, and when the hole was large enough, Damned baboons must be planning an attack on our peaceful village. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Olin? Oh no, if nothing happens, Olin is going to. No, it's too late. What? Fuck! No! 
Jeez. Alondra, you can go home now. I'm sure you're exhausted after this sordid ordeal. Besides, the sorry business now at hand is not your concern. Are you kidding me? The Merg are probably preparing to attack as we speak. We can only hope that our deaths come quickly when they swarm the village. Jesus Christ! Okay, I don't know if it's because I... I don't think it's because I messed up. Because I don't think I would have been able to save him. Heavens to Murgatroyd. Olin is dead. Thank you, Fractal. Rest in peace to Olin. The Merc climbed through and attacked, but their hull weakened the stability of the whole mine and it collapsed. The Great Roar. Say, what? what's going on there? begin arrangements for Olin's funeral at once. You should return to Jess's house and rest up. I'm certain you must be exhausted after the trials you've endured. Well, this sucks. That poor fucking girl is gonna be all alone now. Can I fill about in the house? Poor Olin. At least he will know... At least he will no more suffer... No more suffer the indignity of this troubled world. <laughs> Child crying. This music's too good. It doesn't make sense. I must make an arrangement for a little... Okay. Blibbity blabbity. Wait, can I talk to you now? This is but a small sign of the great wickedness that lies in store for us now, Alundra. How could the gods allow such a terrible travesty? How could they watch as this good man's lifeblood dripped away at the hand of the wicked ones? Is this guy... Is this guy... Seeing one guy die realizing that the concept of god is, uh... Maybe not so good in their world? Nice to get back to another really happy game. Dies. Oh no. Tell me the truth, Alundra. No one else will. Is Olin going to live? Or is he condemned to. Oh, Alundra! This all feels like a strange, horrid nightmare. If it is, why can't I wake up? Oh, Keisha. My sister had strong feelings for Olin. If she learns he's expired, she will most certainly be crushed. can be cruel at times. Events like this are a true test of one's faith, Alundra. I can only pray Keisha possesses the strength to withstand this cruel trial. It's locked. Murder in the mine. Not to spread bad, bad vibes, bro, but Zane and Lyman are in some stinky guacamole. And stuff, Steve. I can't talk to this man ever again. I want to see if anyone else is around to react to it. This man's talking about, about guac. I mean, guacamole is great, but now's not the time. <sighs> Anyone else is around, it looks like. Okay, motorcycle. Whatever you say. <laughs> well, 
Alundra, not too long ago, the people of this land prayed to idols. They were material representations of our gods, you know? But then, quite unexpectedly, the king decreed that all idol worship was forbidden. People had no choice but to comply. We watched the destruction of our statues in tears. About that time, the palace in the North Lake was submerged. Sunk, actually. It was five years ago, but it feels as if we were it was just yesterday, you know what I'm saying? Since that time, we've lost the passion to create. What if the gods became angry and took our passion from us? I'm not saying they did, but it certainly makes me think at night, my boy. But gods or no, I must regain my passion. You know what I'm saying? I, I can almost hear Olin's spirit talking to me, demanding that I make the finest weapons once more. Or even better, demanding I assist in the fight for this land. This is the mining bomb. It's actually just a bomb, since it's used for mining. That's what they call it. A nice way to get through rocks, you know what I'm saying? Alundra? With this, you could easily get into the coal mine, but it's just too dangerous to attempt, my boy. Here's the plan. I go to the mine. I see if it's safe, and maybe I let you go inside. You stay here, alright? One way or the other, I'm going to keep you alive through this. What? I didn't click anything! I just turned around! Elantra disobeys and stealthily takes the mining blobs, sewing it in his- okay. I didn't do that on purpose. All I did was turn around and it took it. I didn't click the take button. Fuck, I wanted to save before I messed around with that bomb. Well, I guess I'm a criminal. You're a thief? I didn't mean to thief. Not on purpose. I thought this was going to be a happy, silly, dumb game. I realized it was going to be good. Such a natural thief she steals without trying. Mm -hmm. Not true. Bomb. So your button sets the bomb. Once lit, throw it immediately. Okay. God damn it. Alright, it was north of here. Unintentional thievery, a likely story. It's just, it's just... Oh, hold on. I just got sent something. One second. Sorry, more fucking house stuff. <laughs> Alright. Can I go into here and defile it? No. So many coins! I need, like, a lot more to uh, try to get the, the health thing that's for sale in the shop. Typical kleptomaniac protagonist syndrome? Yeah, it's not my fault, it's my protagonist. He just has really sticky hands. Oh, this was his house. Gilded Falcon. I don't know what these are. And they don't seem to be in my invent- Oh no, they are! They're like a special- That's interesting. So I have money, gilded falcons, and then keys. Olin's dad lets rob him. I'm gonna- I'm gonna give this falcon to his late betrothed slash girlfriend or whomever she is. 
is my what I'm saying out loud. Pretty sure the mine is this way. Yeah. Where is he? Ooh. Yeah. Wait, what's down here? So weird that I can't go Okay. Hey half Steven Dan, welcome. Yes, I fin <laughs> metal metal gear. Yes, I finished metal gear. Thank you. I did it. Oh, a metronome. Interesting. What's your metronome? Four tables and zero chairs. Uh, maybe they're like the short ones where you sit under them, like on the floor or like a cushion the benefit of the doubt I'm giving them. Whoa. God, they're running. <gasps> Alondra, why do you have that mining bomb? Are you crazy? You can't go into the mine. You should be lucky to come out alive. I refuse to let you go, Alondra. You can't. You shouldn't. Oh, I give up. Promise me this, all right, Alondra? If you sense danger, don't be a hero. Just get out of there alive, okay? Man, he really does want me to be his son. Shortcut to the lake? Who's this guy? Nice crossbow. Climb. Oh, I didn't realize that was a crossbow. Did you find a status? <laughs> uh, I thought the ending was very interesting. Um, and I'll, I'll I'm totally going to play more Metal Gears in the future. Do you fear what lies within the coal mine of the Merg? There's no time for fear, boy. If you won't enter the mine to help those people, I will. My earnest prayers are with those they yet trapped within. Yeah, yeah. I'll kill the Mergle Gurgle. It's over here. It's hard to get into the... Uh, it was the... Metal Gear Solid for the PlayStation? There's a lot of alcohol in here. Why can I walk through this? What the hell? Pick them up. So many things. Uh, yeah, the first one. Sorry. I'm not exactly sure how many there are, so... <laughs> uh, it was my very first Metal Gear, and I really liked it. Hmm. Yeah, this is giving me a very, like, you're gonna have to remember this and come back here with a different weapon or different abilities vibe. Also, allergies are like fucking bonkers here right now. So if you see one of my eyes switching, I, I know, it's really annoying. I can't stop it. Um, I think we're in like the high 10, 11 zone right now. Oh. Uh, I really thought I'd be able to jump. Oh, because I can walk around. Ooh. All right, I'll save those people in a second. Cheryl and I have been dying all day. The allergies are something else. Yeah, it's like fucking up my eyes. No, I played uh, the original PlayStation version. Ah. Jeez. What the hell? Wait. Is that raising? Has I killed them? I think I was supposed to be on that. Hold on. Yeah, I played the original PlayStation version. Uh, everything that you see on my stream is being played with original hardware. Interesting! How am I gonna... 
You're just gonna spit at me? Oh no, I can reach you. Yeah, the, the CD thing didn't give me a hard time, but some other things definitely did. Come here, you little goblins. I bet I'm gonna get like a ranged weapon eventually. Alright, we'll save this. <laughs> Yeah, there were some things that the game just told me while I was trying to figure them out, which I was kind of salty about, but I figured that one out. <laughs> third disc! Fuck you guys. There's definitely no third disc. Nice try. Just like how I double checked and this game only has one. Alright, I'm gonna blow up this wall once I get that one health I have. No, I didn't. The game- I died too many times and the game told me, but I was close. Alright. I hope these dumbasses don't stand in the way. Move! What the fuck? He didn't even take any damage? Whatever. Do I have more than one? Oh! Let's switch that back. What? Shit. Oh, come on! Mm. Alright, let's check the other way first. I wonder if running that is messing it up. Because I can run it again. Locked. Oh, I guess I can't. Is that close enough? No, it's gonna be really close then. It's neat that I have like unlimited bomb now. Okay, it bounces off. That was too funny. There we go, there we go. Probably. It doesn't break it up. Okay. Switch point map. What? Switch point map? Left working area, right shaft one? What's the fuck with that yet? Unless it's rusted solid and not inclined to movement of any sort. Oh, hi, guys. Wait, can I? Ooh. Hello. Hey. Turtle shortcut. Eh? <laughs> there was a game- wait, there was a version of the game in Japan that had a third disc of VR missions, but the game was sold as a separate game in the US called Metal Gear Solid VR Missions, naturally. Wow. That's cool. VR, but... Interesting. Oh, they're those horrible monkeys. you could place a cyborg ninja that sounds cool 
Shit, I don't want to come up here yet. <sighs> Wait. Look, Kiki. How about that? Does that hurt, furless one? Does it make you bleed? Jesus. Look, Kiki. Smash the furless one. Kill, kill, kill them all. No, don't you. Stop it. Ugh. Okay, can I move? Oh, Alondra, help me. Huh? Another furless one. Come close to this furless. <laughs> Come close to this furless one so we can spill both your delicious brains. Fuck. What is wrong with you? Oh, it's slippery. This is wet. Oh, fuck, dude. Did you just fucking die? Alondra, you're a strong warrior with a good heart. Listen, I'm not long for this merciless world. Here, to take this. It's the access key to the power room. Jalen and Zane are still in there. Please help them. What the fuck? Everybody's dying and I can't stop them. Oh, I should totally not be a voice actor. <laughs> I feel like I hear other people stream and voice act and I'm like, wow, you're so good. I'm hot and trash. I'm trying though. I'm trying to get better. We might have enough to get that extra um, health bit. They have a shortage of delicious brains. That's so fucked up. We have three, three, three money. I was so close to saving him too. So fucking annoying. Stupid monkeys. At least finally a game is like, hey, monkeys aren't your friend. They're definitely bad guys. Fuck them up. And you guys are back. Wait, I can have more than one bomb out? This is so much faster. Bullshit. Oh, get out of there, fart turtle. Okay, whatever. So I still can't open this. Unless I can unrust it? I keep trying to do the Alundra thing where you... Oh, wow! Okay, never mind. Where you swing your sword to make the, the bomb go off sooner. Unless I can... Fart turtle may be <laughs> your favorite enemy name now. Everyone always makes monkeys cute and nice, but in reality they're horrible. Yeah. They are. Alright, key. Left, left, right, left. Suddenly sputtered to life. Where are they? God, it's so loud. I gotta get out of here. All right. Jeez. Guys? Maybe I have to... Oh! Here we go! Dad, thank you so much for gifting a tier two dad sub to wanted thing. Thank you, Dad. Oh. Power junction for mine tracks. Oh, I see. But I couldn't change it. Fourteen hacking months. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Sorky Anna. Anna, my good friend. Thank you so much. For resubbing. 14 fucking, I mean hacking. Months. Thank you. Have you played this game, by the way? I feel like for some reason this gives me young you vibes. Like you would have liked this as a kid. Maybe I'm just like crazy. <laughs> Wait. Alundra was one of those games I always saw and never played. Right? Alright. 
Okay, I didn't mean to leave. Ow! What the fuck? Exactly, go how I thought it would. That does hurt them. God damn it. Ow. So many times saw Valkyrie profile for sale in my local game store. I never bought it, and then it was like $300. We have it, and we might play it next. Just depends on if it wins the hole or not. So that's exciting. Austin, welcome back. Yeah. Nope. That almost fucking blew up on me. I think I can blow these up. They're too strong. But you should still vote for Grandia. You're less dead now, that's good. Got Valkyrie profile completed box of starting guide for like 155 in 2019. Everything, okay. So everything has gotten like exponentially more expensive because of COVID and 2020 and everything that happened last year. Um, so it's been pretty bonkers. Hold on, I'm gonna try to... Oh no, I can't. What the fuck? How am I? Hmm. Unless? I can't throw it over. It just bounces off. So that doesn't work. I wanted to- Ow! I had to check that. You fucking- Give me your health. Through there, through there. Ah! Power is on to branch carts to access shaft one. Done. Ah! Uh. Oh. 
I got hit anyway. <sighs> but yeah, our goal is currently Grandia, Valkyrie Profile, or Illusion of Gaia. All good choices. Yeah, we were trying to find even just like a PS3 controller because mine um, started to break. It was having like serious issues with the power button. Um, not the power button, the, the PS button in the middle. Um, and we ended up not being able to find a real version, which is sad. I wasn't supposed to do that. I need to try to switch that um, flip. No, I had to come back because I couldn't get over the truck. There we go. Switch. Yvonne Teal. It is a packed stream. Break. Good. Parts to ground level. Locked. What is that thing? Weird. What? But it's... If it's... Okay. Yeah, hunting for retro games right now is really, really bad, unfortunately. It's just been getting worse, too. of retro games is like way 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 high um, which is why I've been trying not to buy anything new recently especially because um, it's not going to be a good deal we should go back let's go back down that way goodness gracious yeah I miss um Unfortunately, a lot of the, the actual retro game stores around here, um, switch that, have uh, already were, were pricing based on eBay, so um, it was harder to get a good deal around here. Oh. There we go. Okay. Yeah, it is a great time to sell. It's the same as housing. Housing and old video games. The two things that I'm like trying to do right now. Expensive. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, that's fun. Ugh. Hey, bubble turtles. I'll take these. Do you think Sten was planning to eat Ree's brain after trapping him underground? No, I actually like Sten. But maybe. Bloop! that sound? Oh, it's my health! Shit, I've never been low like this before. I mean, I could have used an herb, but I didn't want to. Uh, 
Putin Puyo, thank you for following. Thank you, thank you. Welcome. Wait, how do I get out? Uh oh. Ha ha ha. Oh, right here. Okay. Alright, let's see what that did. Your back. Hey, living Edelon. Relatively speaking, and accounting for inflation, new games are actually cheaper than how much we used to buy them. Oh, brand new ones, yeah. It's like what? SNES games used to be 70 US dollars? Or was it 60? I guess it depended on the game. Had a pirated copy of this as a kid that never loaded. <laughs> nice to see some gameplay. Oh, that's sad and funny. <laughs> Napped for like six hours by accident. Hey, Tylo. Uh, the year is 2055. You're an old, old loser. Just like me. Yeah. Open up. I'm fucking pissed. Uh, I was gonna do this? No. Yes. Right? Was it work too long? Yeah. You're over 60 now? Oh god, so am I. Oops! <laughs> hey, Andy Lee! Yes! This game is very pretty so far. I didn't mean to leave. I wonder if it reset what I just did. My, um, my eyes are really acting up now. Please go that way. Yes! Okay. Sorry, as I said before, the allergies are absolutely bonkers where I am right now, so I'm trying to get used to what my eyes are trying to kill me. Wait, but I still can't do this. I need to get a key from somewhere. Now I can be a cute old person who plays video games. Back in my day, we had a PS2. That's pretty good. Alright, that's wrong still. What did that thing unlock then? Yeah, they should stop giving the guy who owns the company a billion dollars. I think the an issue is that, like... I don't know. did it do? I swear I just did something. I turned something on. Son of a bitch. Pick it up. figure this out. Which means I missed a key somewhere. 
I am prancing around the dungeon. Okay, this area is done. down here again. What did I miss? We turned something on. Yeah. I love that I can, like, throw things at other things. We blew that up. Went in here. There's gotta be something else. Went in there, got that thing. That's done. Get out of my way. These puzzles are a lot um a lot more difficult than I was expecting compared to all the other ones. That's on. Are we done in other games? It's interesting. Ow. It's like a different approach at puzzles. More like a, hey, you figure it out. Fuck if I know. You do it. You know? It's kind of cool. We did this. Go in here. Maybe it's because I accidentally left. No, everything else is still on. Down here? Oh! I didn't see this! Oh! Oh no! The furless ones have returned! We must kill! Yes, kill, kill, kill! Fuck you, monkey! How could you? Jalen doesn't respond. His body is already beginning to stay. Key is loosely clasped in his left hand. Fuck! Stupid fucking monkey! Bastards. All right. That's like what? Three? Three dead people already? Not including my entire ship that died when we got here. I wanted the help. All right, we have the key to get in now. I have to switch this over to the other track to go that way. And then back and then we do it again in the other zone. <laughs> I really like my uh, my ponytail swing. I have to hit that. Jump back into the cart. No health. I really love that I have like one bomb and that's all I need. No. Perfect. It's full of monkey business. <laughs> yeah, rigor mortis in video games is kind of. I mean, rigor mortis shouldn't be setting in yet. I'm pretty sure he just died, but I guess I don't know exactly how long it's been. But according to that other guy, he was still alive. So. Maybe he was wrong. Key. I don't know what that thing is. It's a little terrifying. Bunch of boulders? Alright. What? A save? A save? My god. That's so nice! I was literally just thinking, maybe I shouldn't do this, maybe I should go back and save. Oh. 
<sighs> okay. Jeez. Yeah, the book, the books are only save points. <gasps> Physical strength restored. Magic power. I don't have magic yet. Cool. Okay, so these symbols are our friends. Rigor mortis can occur after a couple hours. But yeah, usually it takes a couple hours. So if like he just died, that wouldn't that wouldn't happen. And it does wear off after a while. Below this level, the tunnel is in the process of being expanded westward. Death by monkey accelerates Argomortis. Why? Because they ate his brains. That's so fucked. I want it. Oh, oh, oh. What? Cool. Caring too much? <gasps> I didn't know I could carry too much. God damn it. Well, at least it stays there. Okay. So if that had gone... Which means this can... Shit! Where does that switch points? West shaft. Right is a U-turn. Yeah, I'm very happy I found those herbs, but I'm sad that I can't carry them. This game is gonna be way harder than I thought. So I need to hmm, make it go straight there. Oh, wait, can I even, I bet I have to go on these poles. to get hit there is platforming i didn't this is more platforming than i was expecting honestly which get, is, makes me a little nervous but at least i have a really good solid shadow hi no come back Damn it. <sighs> Zane is lying in a crumpled heap. A small trickle of blood has crept from the side of his mouth, and his fingers have wrinkled like prunes. He must have been in the water for some time now. That's 
we good that I can hop out of the hole. <laughs> I just ran directly into that awful turtle. Love the puzzles in this game. They tell you very little and you just have to explore and try. Sometimes it can be tricky to see what's possible or not though. Yes, so we, um, not very long ago, we just played um, Lufia 2, which was very, um, I think very kind with its puzzles. So it's interesting to see like a much harder puzzler now. Um, I'm very into it. Uh, blur, blur device? Thank you for following. Thank you, thank you. Okay, it goes to this. Switch. All right, perfect. <sighs> Unfortunately, that's the fourth dead man in the video game that we've physically seen. There's been a lot more. And like for a first dungeon, this is huge. Can jump and grab at the same time? <laughs> I didn't realize I was actually going to be here, but it's awesome. Can I? Oh, damn it! I was going to try to jump on those, not over. thing about Alundra is that its puzzles are tricky, but you, you're always aware that you are, in fact, doing a puzzle. Fair. Oop, oop, oop. Playing along, and it took me three hours to figure out I could jump, jump across there. That's funny. I'm glad you're playing along, though. That's exciting, D. Holmes. an herb, okay? It's not a waste. I needed health. Oh! There's another minecart here, but I can't... Ah, oh, yes I can. along too, but you've caught up to me and got passed in the final. <laughs> Trying to understand how there are rocks you can't blow up with bombs, but can smash through with a minecart. <clears throat> don't, don't question. No, I agree. That's very confusing. Convenience. They should have... Well, we don't know what their restrictions were. Less than 100 until I can get another health... Push the low Push the lower level three times and the upper level ones to start the elevator. So down, 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 up. If it doesn't work, shake things up a bit. The engine's quite old. Oh. Things up. What is this? <laughs> what? Shake things up. Shake 
shake. Shake it up. about the half hour. Really? Gotta say, this is making me feel a lot better. I feel like I'm quite slow at puzzles sometimes. <sighs> I can go over there. Oh, right, because I'm supposed... Nope! <laughs> Locked on it, blew it up with bombs, didn't jump on it. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. Percussive maintenance. Whenever I change things up a bit, I think I'm faster than that. Uh, Alan with tea. Thank you for following. Welcome. Okay. Oop! Boop. Okay, that's not what I wanted. How am I getting it out of here? Oh, I can walk along the damn track now thinking I had to jump out again. God, this game is so fucking interesting already. Now, how do I get up there? Wake up. Yes, give me your bits and bobs. Okay, so we jumped over from that way. This broke here. Ah! It's too far. I think it's too far both ways. You think it looks so much higher, though? That's right. Whoa! Give me something good. Yes! I don't know what these do yet, but I'm sure that's important. Alright, so we got another key. And I have to take that out. Okay. I'm gonna save again if we get back to that little save teleporter thingy. <sighs> the bombs are basically just containers for blasts of gases. Really not that amazing in moving stuff unless you want to put them <laughs> in things you want to destroy. Interesting. That's actually really interesting. Okay, so we turned on the power. What does that affect? And everybody's fucking dead, and I think we got another key. No, we didn't. We used it to turn... That's an herb. I know I love the Wiggly Ponytail, too. I think his design is quite cute. Alright, let's, let's do this again. We're definitely gonna get magic too, which is interesting as well. Um, we don't have it yet, but that little square or triangle, not a square, on the right definitely regens magic. I guess we can go back to ground level and see what happens. 
hate that those are oh, there, but I know what they are. They're herbs. Everybody's dead. I think I failed. Hello? This is exactly what he said before. Various prayers are with those trapped within. Yeah, everyone's saying the same stuff. So we must not have. Too much death? Yeah. A lender gives up. No, I don't give up. All right. Prepare your ears. Game over, bad ending, GG. Because I left the mine too early. Yeah, bad ending. Way to go, me. Fucking failure. Okay, let's see if anything changed up here. By up here, I mean down here, I guess. Isn't this where we found that dead guy? Yeah. <laughs> Friendo. It really sucks. Which dead guy? <laughs> the first dead guy. You know. I love that fucking slime sound. It's so good. Get out of my way. Let's try going back this way. I'm going to figure this shit out. It reminded me a little bit of Secret of Evermore, which I'm really fucking digging. Hey, Austin DM! Hope you're doing well. How could I be in here? We already did all this. It's so weird. Did we go back down this way? Alundra, yes. Well, I don't think, I think the first couple of days Alundra was definitely ahead. Uh, zero pass, thank you for following, thank, thank you. Ah. <laughs> Wonder. I can't re-hit this. It won, it won ahead of Musashi by one today. Uh, Cyanide Punch 85. Thank you for following. Thank you, thank you. What system is this for? PS1. Yeah, that's on. I feel like I turned them all on. It's a good thing the slime monsters love sitting on those trucks. Yeah. supposed to go back. I turned on the big... another power thing. We found the last guy. Wait, what happened to... like door or angle that I'm missing again. No, but it wouldn't be down here. Maybe we were supposed to keep going. Alright, let's let's head back. It's possible that I missed something really obvious further down. After jumping on the um Jumping on the power thing. 
Number three was within five votes of number one. Wow. That's actually pretty cool. I think I'm getting better at making polls, honestly. Feels pretty good. All right, we already got those, technically. We saw it was in them. Oh, maybe... No, we went that way. Fiddlesticks. Go this way again. Yeah, I must have missed something. And this wasn't the mean pole? No. The mean pole is the current pole. Pole certifies this mean, yeah. It is. Oops. Wait. What is this? Right, it did the loop, and we went down here. And this is where the other engine was. Alright, I must have missed something down here, I think. This game does it does have SVS vibes, I agree. Too much good stuff, you don't know what to pick. I win no matter what, so pick pick whatever you're in the mood for. I will take that. I swear I just jumped off of there without really thinking. There we go. What is that? That went to this. Which led to... Trying to look for other, because I've been missing some of the, um, the entrances that look kind of like this. This is on for sure. God damn it! I was supposed to go. said it was an elevator. Fuck. I thought it said engine. Oh. I got healed. Uh-oh. Why? <gasps> Ugh! What, you haven't found a crest here? Wookiee. Lord Melzus has ordered us to find seven crests, seven! Yet you have only seemed to find a pitiful two! Go and do not return without the remaining crests! Wookiee! I will not return until I fulfill your command! Get out of my way! She's got like a big boob. 
Like that? That thing sucks. It's too big. Hey guys. Oh no. Wookie, I smell furless ones. Crush their heads. Smash their bones. Smash, smash, smash. Okay. Can I move yet? Get that item. Hello? All the Merg are dead. I guess we're cheering about this. <laughs> oh, hello. What about the big one? <gasps> Life vessel obtained. Twelve? I can't leave though. I'm gonna have to fight that fucking thing. Kind of place like Zelda, maybe even Secret of Mana. Mm, exactly. You have committed genocide. Cargill Hot Dog Rib Share 100. Thanks, Fractal. I think I'm gonna have to go fight that fucking monkey. <laughs> Zelda, where everyone's dying. Yeah, there you go. Oh! Oh! actually win! Wait, where's this go? Monkeys! We didn't start this fight, but by Lars we finished it. I have to go that way. I wonder if it'll repeat that. Yeah, it is. Okay. I, I have to say, I'm super fucking into this. This game is incredible so far. Oh. What is this music? What is this? Oh, this is their awful tree. God, the stereo on this is bonkers. Whoa. Oh. My God. Did you write all that down? Fuck no, I didn't. It's a rusted shot. Moving it does not seem to be in the realm of possibility. Why is this game so good? should have broken an ankle. <laughs> Sounds like the song from Chrono Trigger, the tribal one. Yeah. It came out of nowhere. It's one of the best games on PS1, and the second one is a massive disappointment. We'll never get anything as nice ever again. Hop over. Uh, Gix, thank you for following. 
Welcome. Well, I'm trapped in this monkey town. This better not be as simple as walking past a monkey. The monkey said we couldn't go in, so we can't go in. That's exactly what I was fucking thinking about, isn't that sad? Oh shit! I can't jump on these, I forgot. Maybe I go back? Aw oh, man, I really like the music there though. You love the second one? I'm I'm quite curious. I don't think we own it, but now I'm... Hmm? Oh, yes! I've been expecting you. I have a theory that the coal mine and the Merg woods are connected. No, really? If that's true, there should be a hidden entrance around here somewhere. Oh, dear Alundra. You're quite late. I was worried. But no matter. I'm just happy you're safe and sound. Lutus and the others went to find you in the coal mine. Instead, they found Zane and the others. The only problem was that they were all... Dead. Well then, I suppose I'll be heading back to the village. My presence here is not really required. See ya. Unhe not helpful. Completely not helpful. Well, at least... I really... Hello? Where's this rock? Why does it have a shadow? What's your deal? Well, I'll never know. Oh, fiddlesticks! I probably should have jumped over there. Mm -hmm. Wait, can I still do it? Yes! No. Oh, whatever. I need 500 so I can get more health. Ooh, it's big money in here. Merkwoods, Forest of Vanilla. I want to go into the Merkwoods now. Don't all rocks have shadows? I mean, okay, maybe all rocks have shadows, but I wasn't expecting to be like that. Merkwoods, beware of falling simians. That means monkeys. That's a cool fucking gate. Yeah, I've got to say. So we did like the very beginning of the game, and now I think I believe I would consider that the first big dungeon. Way more expansive than I was expecting. Very, very, very good. I'm into it. I really, really like this. Pond? I should really go home <laughs> and save, but. It doesn't- it seems like Zelda where it doesn't really let you go to a place that'll fucking kill you yet. Unless you're ready for it. Or it gives you enough warning. Oops. Whoa, there's like a whirlpool. Yes! I'm so close! Whoa. Man, I want to see all of this. <laughs> Octavia just knocks stuff off of our bottom end. Because she's still in a big, big sleepy stretch. <gasps> Can I go look at this? I shouldn't, I shouldn't stray too far. I shouldn't, 
Wait, isn't that the... What's this? I can't, I can't confront. No trespassing, the Riverside pub is under construction. I'm so tempted to break out the map that came with this, but another part of me is like, don't do that, you big dummy. You don't want to spoil anything for yourself. Uh, basic Ryan, thank you for following. Thank you, thank you. Ah, there's so much to do and I can't do any of it yet. Wonder if that dungeon was the inspiration for Evoland 2's minecart dungeon? I've never heard of Evoland. Or Evoland? I'm not sure. Come on. Hopefully as we make our way back we get enough points. <gasps> That's almost enough! Okay, this is... Yes! If this is the pond... Then it's down here. Evil End and... Hmm? And Evil End 2 are PC games that let you travel through different eras of console gaming as you play. What? That sounds cool as fuck! Oh! Earth! How's everyone doing? Who would have known that mining was such a difficult and dangerous job? Oops, sorry. When I grow up, there's no way you're gonna catch me working in a mine. Good. Oh, what, what are you doing here? Alundra, you're here. Sybil has been asking for you, wondering when you would come. Driving me crazy, actually. Would you be sweet and go talk to her? No! I want to save! What? No, I'm not crying. Just go away. What? Uh oh Now what? Ugh. Oops. Oland and the others had a beautiful ceremony. It is a sad time indeed when we must at once surrender four friends to the cold embrace of death. Soon there will be many more departing if the Murg come. The mine entrance has been blocked to delay their advance. However, I am confident they shall find us. To watch a loved one perish so very horribly is to experience the death of innocence itself. It is a sad moment, and yet it forces one to never take life for granted. Well, we learned today that we must live, so... Poor kid. I wonder how she's doing. You okay? Please keep this quiet. I'm so sorry. Hmm? Keep what quiet? Me throwing your pot? <laughs> I want 13 health pips. I don't know why I keep calling them pips. I guess because... whatever. Our prayers did not reach the gods in time, and so Olin passed from our midst. I don't think there were a way to petition his return. That's not how anything works. Your goddess seems weird. Ah, welcome to uprightness, old man. Wine is an expert archer. He could pierce a cherry on your head from a distance of a hundred feet. I, of course, if of course you were dim enough to allow him to engage in such folly. How can we battle the Merg without adequate weapons? We'll be torn to shreds when their savage attack comes. Well, that's why my new dad need challenge accepted. Jesus. That's why my new dad needs to start building weapons again. Fuck the item lady. That's the Oh, why are you here? As long as I've got Klein with me, I'm not scared of the Merg. I don't know where the shop lady is. Is it this? Yes! I'm finally ready! No, no, no! Oh, I'm sorry! A life vessel? Yes! Finally! Oh! I only have $2 now, I don't care. 
or whatever, Gilder. Oh, there's sunlight on my hands. Do you see that? <laughs> it's down there. Yay! Thank you for your patronage. Please come again. I wonder if it comes back. The main character really walks with gusto. Yeah. I love his little ponytail swinging in the wind. Oh, it doesn't come back. Okay, that's good to know. Let me just set this bomb off in your shop slash house. All right. I don't remember where that girl lives, so. Oh, here she is. I've been waiting for you, Alundra. While I am awake, I have dreams more vivid than anyone can imagine. Not normal dreams, but terrifying visions of futures not yet beheld in this reality. So you must help me. Wait, I'll show you what I mean. Here, will you take my hand? I don't really have a choice, do I? No. Please hold my hand. Fine. Can you see it, Alundra? I know that you can. You are seeing the dream I'm having as we speak. I need to save. I don't want to go in here. I just finished Monkey Town. No! from here beast or I shall slay you with by the gods <laughs> monkeys aren't allowed to dance oh it's that thing Same as Melzar, his ass or something. <gasps> Wait, that's the monkey. We were just there. What the fuck? Are they inceptioning? What is happening? Alundra, my dream will become a reality. They all do. That fact frightens me more than anything else. You have to help, please. Okay. I'm just gonna go save now, if that's okay. Sorry, I need your gems. God damn it. Why are you in front of my house? Thank you, Alundra. I think you and Sybil are becoming friends, aren't you? How cute. Yeah, we're real good friends. Hi, new dad. Alundra, you've returned. This is good. I know you're tired, but you should pay your respects. You didn't know Olin and the rest well, Alundra, but trust me, they were good people. Take the flowers to Olin, my friend. Olin always did like a nice bouquet. Never afraid to stop and smell the roses. Be careful, though. Rumors of a creature seen near the cemetery are running wild in the village. I don't want you taking any chances. You know what I'm saying? Receive the flowers. 
They smell nice. I'm gonna go save though. Olin sounds like he was a really fucking cool dude. Beloved by all and lover of flowers. Oh. After being in a mind full of slime and monkeys, I'm sure everything smells nice. Yeah, don't forget the, the water in there too. Okay. Unfortunately, my friends, we have come to the end of the stream. It's been seven hours and my eyes are leaking because of allergies. <laughs> Thank you all so, so, so much for being here. Uh, if you are new, that's fucking cool. Thank you for coming in. Um, we did just finish Metal Gear Solid today. We are going to continue playing Alundra until we beat it. I stream every day from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Except the weekend. So, I'm not streaming on Saturday or Sunday or anything. Uh, reminder that Friday will be starting a bit late. Um, I'm getting my first vaccine. Yes! Um, yeah, we have a Discord if you'd like to join. Uh, vote in the poll for the next game. Exclamation mark Discord and exclamation mark poll. And I will see you all tomorrow. I hope you have a really lovely night! Good Goodbye!